Uh huh. Facts. Henny. Ooh. 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 I ain't see him. He's stealing. Always like a fucking snitch. And they be acting like bitches. That's why they always get stitches. Mm. Yeah. Uh, uh. I got a Henny bottle. And I came to play. Ooh. Hey, hey. Mm. Get crump, nigga. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, that's fucking sound. Hey, hey, mind you, he was, uh, on, he was on crack when you did that. Facts, <laughs> ain't nothing better than a crack <laughs> holiday song. Bro, you know how many times made crackness? Dmx was on crack and off crack more times than. Oh, crack is a powerful. My son was on and off. That's what drugs do. Son, crackheads really can do anything. Like them niggas are impervious to like raid. Like you. Not- <laughs> You know, like you know, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Though. Like they're like cockroaches. Like just, just nothing stops them, niggas. Like the MTA won't stop them. Bills won't stop them. The weather won't stop them. The niggas is always fucking warm. Not gonna lie, there's something about doing like the idea of doing coke in like the '80s, like mm-hmm. kind of like appealing. You know, back then, if he was all coked up in, in the prime of no, in the '80s, that's it was the wild, prime of the cocaine. I'm 100 percent sure if we were in the '80s. We'd be, I would I'd, be dead. I would have been definitely coked. I, I don't I'm think people die. I don't think no, many people die. I don't think people die that much for cocaine. Okay, but I, I, think gotta, co- I think cocaine is not as dangerous. As people nigga, I got a weak body. Yeah, it's, I think you can overdose on it if you like while out. But like, yeah. very, it's usually because it's cut with some other shit. And it's right, it's, I don't think cocaine. Right. I don't think is really that dangerous in general. It depends where you get it from. Though. Yeah, if right. you're getting, yeah, like, yeah, if you're getting exactly. some pure like good not quality, if you're getting like pure good quality crack. cocaine, it's pretty. It's pretty you get it from Santa. Crack too. I don't think crack is is that bad either. But crack, only difference between coke and crack is you smoke. Crack is bad. It's the same thing. No, crack is not, whack. The same thing. Oh, crack is fucking whack. My son dick. took the dare class before he got here. I see. Yeah, come on, man. <laughs> if you take crack, you suck dick. I think that was a commercial. It was like, yo, like you, you do crack, you're gay. <laughs> you like, saw, um, you saw the mayor of. Uh, I wonder how gay people feel about like that. Like, wait, oh, okay, like I'm just gonna do crack. some more crack. Like, right, <laughs> I'm gay. I might as well commit. Like, well, I'm gay. Might as well double down. Do some crack too. Yeah, and some dick. Mm. I fit the script. Bro. You saw the mayor of. Uh, you saw that old mayor of uh, Toronto that used to be on crack. No, That's no one pays bro. attention to the six, bro. No, nah, he was like famous. It was crazy. What his name? Something Ford. Something I Ford. wouldn't be mad if uh, my mayor was doing crack. Well, no, the Blasio doing crack would be wild. <laughs> he, really, you know, he really like you doing coke. Hey. I feel hey. like he, does. Hey. Hey. he looks like he looks, he looks like, like one of those guys that would do coke. Yeah. Like, yeah. Hey, 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 yo. We're gonna raise the MTA to 425. 425, okay? Okay. Hey, yo, my rock, bro. He pulled up to the, to the presidential debates like it was like a freestyle cipher. He pulled up, <laughs> he pulled up, spit like 10 bars, and he left. He was like, yo, Biden, your head ass is old as fuck. And then he's left. So that was like the whole thing, bro. Like, damn, yo, that was hey, your run? Say, like, hey, yo. It, it lasted like a month. Joe oh, Biden. Shit, you do look like Santa. I'm we he is no, mad red right now. He does look like Santa Claus. Yo, yeah. you think I get Yo, my shit bleached? Yeah, yeah, I was about to say you should get it Are white. You do that for Santa Claus? Yo, I like Yo, that fuck the no, game no, no, up. No, 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 no. You have to just get the beard. The fucking beard just get the bleach. beard. What else is he gonna bleach? No, I wanna get bleached. No, no, no. I wanna get bleached. It's not that. Ah, I kind of wanna do it for a month. Wait for it. No. I get the blonde bears. No, it's great. You definitely will get them. I mean, you're balding, so. I'm not balding. I'm bald. There's a difference. I'm fucking just bald. All right, you're bald. Oh, it's there. Like, I, I, I mean, you're going to get off the there. No, I committed. I committed. <laughs> I'm, com- I'm not like one foot in, one foot out. Nigga, I'm it's bald. It's like stage four. Right, yo, does this. No bro. funny shit. We got to talk about this. Oh, hold on a second. Hold on a second. Can I only get poof position? Dude? Yo, welcome to another episode of the Complete oh. Irresponsible Podcast. Um, Yo, my bad for taking so long to introduce it. But we here. We live in full effect. It's not Christmas yet, but it's Dickmas somewhere. I, I, I. Um. <laughs> Look how casually he said that. <laughs> <laughs> he said his dick somewhere. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> oh, All right, no, 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 no. But, um, yo, like, that's my biggest fear, um, male pattern baldness, because, like, my hair is starting to thin now, mm-hmm. um, which is not a bad thing. I'm fucking 24, but in today's society, it's awful at 24. Yeah, like, at 24 in the 20, 1980s, once you're, like, 26, die, like, then it's like, ah, right, right. I'm trying to hold down until I'm 30. After 30, I'm going to let it go. Yeah, I'm, but right I'm now, I'm like, yo, over. damn, like, my size is thinning, and I'm like, fuck. Your sides? The, uh... Oh, the, the, the hairline. Yeah, 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 No, it's not receding, it's just it's thin. Just thin? Yeah, like, when I grow it out, you can notice. If I cut it, you won't. 
Mm. But I'm just like, fuck. Like, what am I gonna do when I get to that point? I'm just gonna cut it all off. Fuck it. And I'm gonna get a gun. How does that correlate? I don't know, man. How does I'm, that correlate? I'm 5'6", 140 I'm pounds. I'm gonna need a gun. Bald. You be like, yeah, I don't know either. Like, I know, unless man. I gain some fucking weight, like, or get a beard, I'm I feel fucked. Like you look, I feel like you look, I'm look like, like a, Lex Luthor. I feel like you look like an unsharpened pencil. <laughs> <laughs> the opposite of the racer side. Yeah, now nah, what's that nigga? Um, what's that nigga in the wheelchair? Um, is it Les Luther? That was the nigga that was in the wheelchair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah but I'm talking about the one from the current Batman, Batman versus Superman. Yeah, because there's been a couple. The That's skinny one, the skinny one. I'm gonna look like him. Lex Luthor was paraplegic. A yeah, he was in Batman versus Superman. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna look like a fucking paraplegic. This is gonna be life. trash. But I don't know. I guess I'll just cut it off. What about you? What are you gonna do? I'm gonna eventually have to cut this to. You do the uh, plasma. The, the, it runs in the family, so you can tell if I'm like mad family members. Oh no, they, they have afros. They had afros until they were like 75. Oh, you probably mm-hmm. get that. Yeah. Yeah. See, good. like, that's the thing. I'm in that weird, like, my dad's bald, but everybody on my mom's family, like my granddad and them, like, have long hair. So I, I think, think that's it comes why I haven't from lost the mom's side. I think hair usually comes from the mom's side of the family. So I think I'm valid. It all depends on the stronger gene. I don't know. You know That's that like goes. the most fucked up thing about procreating you. something. Like, yo, if I have a kid, yo, I'm gonna <laughs> make sure like I have a woman with great genes, my nigga. Like, I'm gonna ask the questions like, yo, like, do you get cancer so you often? Can, you say that, and then but she got she you got can a weed on. You them. can't tell. You no, know. I'm you gonna know? take her blood sample. That while doesn't she's even sleeping. matter. Huh? You can modify your kids. What do you mean modify? Like a <laughs> you play like two, a 2K you'll, player? You play 2K my player. You play 2K my player. You're laughing, but you go to you go to the haircuts store. Hey, you walk in. Explain this. Explain this. Explain Like like if I wanted my kid to come out with blue eyes, there's a certain place. To be an Aryan? To. No, Connie, Connie did that to make his kid, but only to pick the gender. I think he wanted a boy, so he, they he went there. And they they did their they moved the shit. Oh, they was playing with her pussy. Yeah, that was it. Kills pussy, just like <laughs> yo. Oh, oh Ray J was here. Nah, nah, no, <laughs> yo, I don't know. They did, I think they do. <laughs> Ray J did hit it first. Oh okay. shit, Ray J was here. Oh, now we know. Oh. He carved it on the wall. Mm. I saw the he tape. J- he didn't wow. even carve oh, it right. Shit. He carved you're, Jr. I left some glasses. He left his. He left his new glasses there. Oh, you see is this? <laughs> you look like, to the yeah, left of the you. wall says Ray Unless I'm broke that shit He said I don't care But nah I didn't know you can genetically modify your kid So wait so if I want my kid to be Goku <laughs> yeah, Niggas doing hella Kamehameha Oh no Sasuke I want my kid to be an Uchiha Fuck out of here Sharingan Come on man Okay. All seeing eye <laughs> Like come on man like, If, if I'm gonna fuck with my kid's <laughs> DNA I might as well make him lit he ain't gonna be no bitch. <laughs> make him lit. Hey, nigga ain't gonna be no bitch. Like I'm gonna make him into a transformer. Like, if you had the option to give him a 13 inch dick, would you give him a 13 inch? No, that's dick? just weird. That's excessive. No? That's just being a pedophile. It, it is excessive. That's pre pedophilia. I want my son to have a, a 18. Why do you care what your son's dick is doing? That's just weird. Because I want him to. That's cool. I don't. I'm just asking you. Okay. Nah, I don't care about my son's dick. <laughs> you don't care like, about your son's. Dick. That's like the um. So it? so you'd want him to have a two two inch dick. Whatever he got, you want to wish got. you want to wish a two inch dick on your son. I'm not wishing that on my son. What um, are you wishing on him? Nothing. An average penis, like his average? father. You want <laughs> <laughs> something, something modest? Yeah, something modest, <laughs> not modest. Not an iPhone two, but not an yeah. iPhone XR. Like no, nothing too flashy. <laughs> uh, no, um, maybe a gimbal. I don't. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. Whatever he's happy with. No. You know, you can modify that too. Right? I'm not yeah. doing that though. You know, there's um, there's a surgery where you they cut like one, they cut like one muscle in your inside your your dick or something, mm-hmm. and it'll make your dick like two inches longer. But you, the only thing is your your dick doesn't stay like you can't control you can't control the shit. Oh, <laughs> you know, it, doesn't, it doesn't stay up. It'll be hard, but it just won't be like flat. It'll be it'll, like it'll mini be hard, but it'll be like. It'll be directional. <laughs> you know you. Huh. Damn, I, I don't. I don't want to go there. What? No, go ahead. No, I think I know what you're talking about. I don't. You, you're talking about the. It's not supposed to be curved. No, no, no it's not curved. Too much. No, it's not I, I don't mean curved. I don't mean curved. Like when you have a dick, your dick is 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 up. Yeah, but if you do the surgery, your dick won't be up. It'll be hard, but it won't be up. It'll be like hard, but it's like drooping. So so it'll be, it'll, be it'll be like so it's like sad. Yeah, it's like when you get hard and then you jerk off no, it's and then it's something that mid phase. It's like mid-phase. It's, like it's, like it's like this, <laughs> like the hats. It'll be hard. This is just you know. Yeah, it's like, like it's like that, but if it was hard, it was well, hard. Yeah, you, know, like, you know the vibes. That's well, probably what the porn stars did then. Nah, they pumped that shit. Pump it up. 
Yeah. I think porn stars, male porn stars, don't they like? I think they take needles straight to the dick with Viagra. Needle dick. Is that myth or is that some real shit? No. Mm-hmm. That is, Alex used to do that. Yeah. How do you He's tell a you? Porn star? No. How Why do you explain? He was a dick doctor. Who? My friend Alex. Mm-hmm. And y'all just be talking about dicks all day? Well, he told me a lot about dicks because... Yeah, bro, I saw this fat cock today. Yeah, he, know, he know a lot about like, penis. <laughs> yeah, he knew too much. So yeah. let me ask you, like, if you was a porn star, how do you address that to your children? Wow. You can walk through the frame. You're good. Yeah, like, how do you address that to your kids? Like, um, if, like you, if you was a porn star, what are you saying to your children? I mean, what do you think all these, all these girls that have been thotting, like, on OnlyFans, on publicly, on OnlyFans? Yeah. Yeah. That's what we're, we're going to lead to next. Fan, OnlyFans, but I just want to see from the male perspective, what would y'all, like, how do y'all tell your daughter, actually? You got to make it hard, because you're a kid, you're like, yeah, I'm going to be fucking, nigga. <laughs> but if it's your daughter, like, Yo, it's I harder. Have buy, I have to buy your sneakers somehow, you know? Mm. Sometimes Slim adults dick. make choices in enough. order to put food on the table. I'm giving my child a spanking. I'm telling him to go away. Damn. Why are you aggressive towards your children? I'm like, yo, there's not, not with that. They're gonna call you. First of all, they saw my penis, <laughs> so now I have to spank you for seeing my penis on uh, Pornhub. You've been, because that means that you've been doing something deviant, something that you shouldn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I gotta flip it on you and make you look a bad person, like you ain't would, shit. Would you guys pay for an OnlyFans account? No, never. It's free porn. Yeah, OnlyFans that is so is stupid. Mo- and I'm gonna be real with you. Someone ends you up putting it on Pornhub. What? What? Okay, so it it depends on what happens in the OnlyFans. But it's gonna, it's gonna end it's, up on Pornhub. So you can make requests. It's a subscription service where they do whatever the fuck they want. They just send you videos. They got their own shit going. That looks on. sick. Isn't that part of Snapchat already has things like that? Yeah. Yeah, but you get a, that's like someone's Snapchat Premium, but you get to someone's uh, hmm. OnlyFans account too. It's the same thing. I don't know. Would that matter to me? Because usually stupid. I just want a quick bus nut. What if she like custom makes it to you, where she's like moaning your name while she's like. Uh, uh. It's you not, gotta pay extra for that though. Thank you. It's not gonna be worth it when it, you're done. Wait, hold on. Actually, it, it sounds minuscule, but that, that might actually make a difference between me subscribing. My boy, spe- yeah, that's my name. My, my boy spends hundreds on on like on t- girls on Twitter just to like just send them videos and shit. That's sad. Of like and specific requests too. It'll be that, like it'll be like I want you with your yeah, yeah, underwear, dope, your underwear dope. around your ankles. I want you to, to go three times in a circle. You serious? I'm dragging it, but yeah, that's he, dope. But he be he be telling him exactly. What to now do. I know why. But he spends like one fifty like on a video like that. You think there's a nigga version of OnlyFans? Like Only Mans? No, mm-hmm. that's gay. Um, Only Mans. No, <laughs> 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 that sucks as hell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, it's 2019, only, man. I don't judge if you mans. watch OnlyMans. Nah, I was asking, like, do you Who's think there's a man only? version of OnlyFans? But like, I mean, for I think, women, I like, only, to like, oh, like, I think it's only do that fans, thing with your bro. dick, like, we just. I think it's OnlyFans, bro. Oh. Uh, you know, be dope, I'm trying to figure out because that seems like a lucrative idea. Oh, my God, do spank my monkey and name. Just like you, you don't even spank your monkey so man, much without it being interesting. Chartreese. Yeah, like, dude. Chartreese. Dude, dude, you can make stuff. money off of spanking my monkey, though. You gotta fuck, like, a watermelon or some shit just to get these bitches interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, like, and dude, you're crazy when they ask you for a dildo. Yeah, you'll put the dildo on your fruit. butt. Yeah, he knows his way around some fruit. Facts. <laughs> you gonna be the next cucumber, nigga? If he could you're not gonna be Salt Bay. You're gonna be um, Asparagus Bay. Huh? You're gonna be Asparagus Bay. What would I Asparagus Bay. I put a string around my dick and just. Have you ever put your dick in an inanimate object? No. A couch? You put your dick in a couch though. Nah. You fucked. I'm you, not you, a weird ass nigga. Like, no. Uh, Never once <laughs> said so. this couch looks I'm lusty. Gonna, I'm not gonna say no because mm-hmm. I, it, from the top of it, that's shit that I store in the back of my head, and I <laughs> no. and I try to like delete the files. Oh man. <laughs> I've never once sat there and said, "Yo, this couch look wild, lusty, my nigga." Like. I think I remember, crazy, I remember so when Fleshlights I remember when Fleshlights first came out and no one had them and I was like there's like I, I found a thing online DIY Fleshlights you can make Oh you're sick So you grab like a paper towel roll you get a rubber glove you get like some sponges you throw that shit in just throw, just throw some lotion in there and then How did that go? You're a sick it was, fuck It was decent yeah, it was actually The cleanup decent. wasn't good but yeah it was decent yeah, clean. Well, You wanted to just throw it out? It was a DIY I mean, Why'd you throw, throw it out? out? No I mean this after you just that's the thing. After you come in and you throw it out, yeah, because the cleaner you know, use it once. You know, you get a couple of rounds. <laughs> yeah, all right. Trying to save money. Hey, I hey, mean, like, listen, I, I, I buy stuff on Ali, oh, I buy stuff off of AliExpress. You uh, make shit come stuff. So I, I, I did it once. We were not the same. School. I was like, yo, I want to try. Want to know what same. the hype is? Same. Same. Want to know what the hype is? You know. Mm-hmm. I spent one like fifty bucks. Yeah. You got you got an actual flashlight. Never, never had that. a flashlight. It was a it was a miserable fifty bucks. I've never not, not once thought of that. It was similar because I was too cheap. 
Mm. Flashlight was like a hundred bucks. Right? I have a hand. Nah, I mean there's like off brand ones and shit. No. Oh, like it's not Nike. Is there? You know, it's a D-Dose. A D-Dose. <laughs> you know, <laughs> a D-Dose flashlights. <laughs> yeah, that's a good business to get into. The sports like um flashlight? brands made flashlights <laughs> for athletes. Like yo, just when you it, need bro. to come before a game. Just like that Bruce Blair's just, just instead of Rocket 10 you got mm. <laughs> Flesh Love or something I don't Pussy know 10. Pussy, Pussy 10 Pussy 10 oh, Nike man. just beat it ooh Nike <laughs> cut the check what's bitch. Adidas slogan you mean, you mean Fappy Adidas has a slogan they only have one right just flap it just do it as a good ass slogan Not yeah cause it applies to everything it. just like, do it like damn man you might just I beat it. I also gotta you can like, apply that to racism I day, like damn you're right I should just do it Misogyny. <laughs> I should just. I, don't, I never thought of it that way. <laughs> well, hold on, hold on. I was thinking about not doing it. <laughs> now I would do it. Yo, we gotta get back to this. How? I'm sorry, cause we got off tangent real quick. How do we tell women? How do women tell their kids they have an OnlyFans account? Like, how does that go down? Let's get back to that real quick. They don't. Why would they tell them? I don't think because if do. their kid comes up to them and says, "Mom, what is this?" Do. Be like, how oh, do you explain I that? Oh no, that's just that's just some adult stuff, honey. But why What is that Why does that look like mine And why are you putting your finger in it Is that something I can do <laughs> uh, Right it, it, it's, it starts to open up You know different That dialogue Yeah that dialogue Some people are crazy. open about it though Sometimes they're open about it Cause you have to understand Imagine you as a young buck In class And niggas go Hey Oh I could rap I'm tight bro. That could be I'd be Yo is this your mom's That's Yo her pussy wild fat You gonna be sitting there Face red as shit Hairline receding, mad tight. Like you gonna be like, yo, nah, what the that's fuck? Brutal. Like that's a brutal beating. I I, I enter okay. in middle school. Like, and, come on, and man. Like, like I jerked off to your mom last night. Oh, D. You can never <laughs> say shit ever again. You gonna be like, yo, shut uh, up, nigga. You, or what? Or I'm gonna beat mommy to your mom or again. Oh, you, you can be that you one kid that around. owns it. You can be that one kid that owns it. Be yeah, like, my yeah, mom pussy fat. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Yeah, that shit wild fat. Yeah, hey, yeah. I bet you beat my sh- I bet you beat your shit to that shit, my nigga. You never gonna get it. You never gonna get it. You never gonna get it. Like I was in that shit. That's where I came from. Uh-huh. <laughs> Imagine coming from that, bro. Mm. There's nothing you can say. Anything you say is just wild fucking <laughs> awkward. Like every time you try to argue with niggas, like it's just like yo, you're losing and you think you're winning. Like, oh you wish we had that pussy. <laughs> what? <laughs> but yeah, I do. Um mm. I mean, actually, she's still doing OnlyFans. She has a new I episode. I call her mommy every day. <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to. I'm going to pay for her OnlyFans, and I'm going to have her do st- weird shit to my um Space Jam boxes. Okay. I would, I would pull up to the crib, and she's like, hey, yo. Oh, Tommy J719. It's nice to see you. I, I hope. I'm going to say I hope. I hope that my significant other in the future is like that. She has an OnlyFans? No, not not OnlyFans. <laughs> like, if, if 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 I'm in bed one day and I'm just like, yo, you know what? The start of OnlyFans. Turn around, three sixty. What's that to do with oh, OnlyFans? <laughs> like, oh, in general, like OnlyFans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Like, like she'll do OnlyFans shit. Subservient. For me. Most girls that I've had wouldn't. That sucks. Nah. Some shit like that. Man, you fucking with the wrong bitches. Man, listen. You can give commands, but some, some commands are you gotta you push nah, it. You like I, mean, I want I'll, I'll, I'll want, be giving mad I commands. Love pushing the Yo, turn around. <laughs> like Spread your you legs. Mean. Do your taxes. <laughs> do your taxes. <laughs> yeah. Yo, what's your I four ninety five? Like, yo, yo, come yo, on. You know what? Fill out taxes and put one thumb in your asshole. Mm-hmm. Why you do that? Like <laughs> <laughs> How many dependents you got? Put zero on that shit. Yeah, I yeah. Her, I remember I told the girl to spit on it, and she she just went like two. <laughs> like bitch, <laughs> yo, you really fuck you with me. You better do that shit from the heart. I want to hear. <sighs> Y'all fuck with some weak bitches. I'm sorry. I want to hear that. No, same here, man. You got sex with like, black girls? <laughs> guys, you got sex with black girls? I had, yeah. Oh, you must be having some I weak did, black chicks. I, I don't. I don't think it's. I've never had that issue. I'm sorry. I've got neck from black. I've never I, had that issue where it's like I fucked a couple. I think it's a race thing. White girls like to suck dick like they're trying to die. Like it's like women's suffrage. Thank like they're you. doing it for women's suffrage. Thank you, white girls. It's like yo, you don't gotta do that. All my white girls, thank you it's so depends, much. Bro. Every girl's different. You like my? I, 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 I like your big fat cock you know. in my mouth. It's like yo, you don't gotta say that. You know? I've, I've had a couple black girls. And I don't. I, I wasn't like, oh, this is what that was. So. Mm. Like, I, I I wasn't really surprised. Like, she was putting work. Sucks Absolutely. to be you. But like, you know what it is. You're not. You're not looking at the um the Carfax. That's you know, all. my most important thing is you just gotta check the facts. Is effort. 
As long as she's putting in like a nah, genuine, effort don't mean genuine shit. Genuine effort is no. number one thing. I'm dead ass. No. Dead ass. As long as as long as she looks like she's trying, I'm happy. I'm like, oh no. my goodness, she's He sounds like an old Westbury professor. <laughs> I'm dead ass. I'm, I'm dead ass. I'm like I'm like I'm like a professor in an underprivileged okay. area where I'm just like okay. I'm just like, you know what? You really put in a good effort. You know what, Brian? I don't believe that. I like that shit. I like that shit. Nah. You're dumb. Cause what? you know what happens when good you put job. an effort in it's not good? Yo, that nigga's dick was wild wax, son. What the fuck? Nah, I'm gonna be your effort needs to be an A. I'm gonna be real with you. Mo, mo, most girls exaggerate that, bro. Really Sometimes yo, girls be wild, stupid, bro. They, they, oh, I'm sorry, it, it be extreme. <laughs> yo, I hate to say it, but I met some girl, bro. Here goes the feminist. <laughs> no, I'm I heard, I heard some <laughs> nah. girl. She was talking about this dude she fucked, and, he, and her, she was like, his dick was like nine inches, and I know she was like. And, but some and girls think that's like, small. They, I'm like, they yo, go eye level. I'm like, yo, is that, that's, it was nine inches. I'm like, she's like, yeah, it was like that big. I'm like, that's like six inches. Are you supposed to? Stop? She's like, no, I mean, no, it was like. I that, mean, it's hard to scale. Like, they have no clue it's to eye level scale, like. because they scale it eye level. Yeah. If you start scaling shit eye level, you and you're not, you're not, you're not working in construction. You're not gonna. Understand. I mean, like we have the. Re- I think maybe just because we have the reference, like we know it. No, gets, we know. We know we measured time. our shit for like, years. We'll see another. Dude. <laughs> another yeah, I see another dick, and I was like, oh, that's another, my dick. Another dude, right. like another dude's dick. A dick. Some dick falls out in front of you. You'd be oh, like, that's oh, that's dick. six inches. Yeah, that's like, oh, it's six three quarters. Like, yeah, six three quarters. Yeah, 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 yeah bro. On a, yeah, hard. Chubby. You you know what size he is hard and soft. You already know. Mm. No such shit. You just you know. We you know what sucks when you give a a girl the soft penile, like. You're not really into it, but you're just doing it just to do it. So it's not like diamond yeah. hard. I mean, I've been living for it. They don't be knowing that shit either. You gotta squeeze it at the base so that shit poke out. Oh, no, no, not squeeze it. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes. I had that. You, that gotta, you that gotta brutal. You gotta, I've never done uh, that. That's what she said. She told, she told me round two after I was done. And I was like, oh, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> and I just went in and it was just uh, brutal. Tragic. I had to do that. Uh, and she was uh, just like, "Yeah, you you look like you're, you're not you know having fun." I'm like, "No, this that's, is, what, that's, that's no. what that's what eating, that's what eating, <laughs> pussy, eating pussy is for. You gotta like take a break. Right. You know, like let me recuperate my dick sometimes. Mm-hmm. If, if, if no, you fuck yeah. ladies, I know there's like less than one lady listens to this, but if you listen to this, nah, there's actually a lot of women. More male, um, there's more women than men that listen to this Ooh, podcast. Say Ooh, interesting. Say yeah, ladies, so, we really be out here. Thank you, ladies. If a dude is fucking Yo, you, thank you, bitches. If a dude is penetrating, <laughs> I'm joking. You, if a dude is penetrating you and then he he jump out randomly to start eating your pussy, his dick is soft as hell. And something's no, going no, that's a fucking lie. Don't speak on my dick like that, nigga. Yeah, no. Nah, when I do that shit, that means I'm about to come. Oh, that's oh, or so I'm just really so into it. And I like to do intervals. Intervals. You got a relay? Yeah, four by one. But I'm just the four. That's, that's not good. That's you what I'm about to know. I gotta take intervals, a break. Bro. Yeah, is, either, is either I'm out of nut and I need to take a break or I just want to eat it again. I think I've noticed the number one thing is you got to be like steady. You got to like have a consistent like. You nah, got I go on like I go in there like a like wildebeest. A, you got a strong consistent stroke. It's a wrap. I go in there like a, a wildebeest. Right. I don't even care. You're yeah. right. Whatever happens from You're there right. happens from there. And the thing I noticed when I was young too, I like to I like to do it fast as fuck. I mean, eh, you can't yeah. do it fast. Like now you, back you get older, you don't. Yeah, even if you go back. It depends. All right. I don't go fast when you're doing more. like any type of missionary esque position, there's no reason to go. You got to take your time with that because that's like that's intimate. But when you go back shots. I can't control myself. Well, I don't you never need it. to go full speed. Anymore. I don't go into it. You never need to go full speed. No, you don't need like to. But with back shots, it's like most, fuck it. Eighty percent at most. Eighty percent nah. of your full speed. At back shots, you I'm never going need to in. break eighty. Back shots, I'm going one hundred and ten. Because I'm going sonic. Time, if you go one hundred and ten, you know that shit ain't sustainable. You're gonna last five minutes. It does, that's why you do at the end. That's Duh. Even at the end. If you're gonna go one hundred percent, one hundred and ten, you're ending. Yes, you're ending. At the my ending is like. Yeah, it's like nah, a. I don't, I don't like it's like, wow, this movie was good. I used to. I used to, I used to, I used to that's the climax like, of the movie. I used to like, like that, but now I'm. That's I'm a, end game. I'm a steady. But I get it. Slow it down, steady. I, I get it. Nah, I get it. don't like that shit. Wow, and now it's like women don't like that shit. Yo, believe it or not, and women they don't like really want change. their back cracked. Yeah. And right. they don't like it when you change position a million times too. You gotta like. It depends. Yeah. If you change positions, no, every girl. So define a million times. Girls like consistency. If you define a million times. What's how many? What's too much? So, so like, if I'm every, thinking four if, positions. If is every enough. five minutes you change it. Oh no, I'm doing four good. positions and that's it. But yeah, like, it, it depends how long you, you you're in each position. If you're doing like I'm fifteen be there minutes a minute. position, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. But because fifteen was, times four. What is fifteen times four? Five minutes here, five minutes there. What's fifteen times four? That's an hour. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. That's fair. So four positions in an hour. Okay. Yeah, and that's the fine. last one is the finisher. Whatever it is, whether it's the your head, what is your feet, like all the way up there. Or like your back shots, or you gotta do the back shots where you pummel them down into the um into the mat. mat. So when they're just laid straight. Oh no, I'm brutal. <laughs> like 
I'll I'll like crush her head. I'm, I'm heavy, nah. man. I can't like I can't hold myself up that long. I'll be like fucking heavy, so mm. I, gotta, I gotta like find my spot. He's <laughs> like, that's why I like the fuck standing up because I, I could my legs could support me. <laughs> you know what the one I like is when you're um oh this is a terrible episode. Yeah, obviously. when you're fucking um laying down, and she's on top, and you just go into the power driver, and you're just like. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> like a fucking yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I did that. You know what's funny? Because some girls don't know what to do when they're on top. Like, they, yeah. they try to ride. No, because it's for like, them. And I'm like, yo, I'm not feeling this at all. It is. <laughs> just, you just pull it in your seat. Bro, they're just sitting there like this. It's no, like, yo, what the fuck shit. is that? I hate that shit. Because it is for them. It is for them. I don't think it's for them anymore. They're, 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 yeah. They're trying to figure it no, out like bro, a science project. For, them. for me, I just get bored. That's my like break. Hold on, yeah. Hold on. When when she when she wants that position, she fills the whole thing, and I'm doing mm-hmm. nothing. That's my break. My take is like, nah, but sometimes that could be dangerous. Okay. If you start wilding, you know, you just power like, Nah. Oh. The, oh. the only time I I, I, I get that Dave Chappelle nut <laughs> and I wrap it up is. Like it's missionary, yeah. Mm. It's missionary. Missionary's dangerous, man. You know what my favorite position is now? It's when she's laying on her side mm-hmm. and you fucking it from the side. That's elite now. I don't know why the pussy just be just be just be it'd be wetter. I think it just it'd be, be wetter. It's be that should be Clay Thompson. It's like a class. I probably should have called my pussy Clay Thompson. That's weird. Oh, it's <laughs> it's kind of weird. I'm Clay ignoring Thompson. it. I'm, I'm waves. Okay. Oh, so <laughs> ask, I'm wet, but whatever. I'm gonna. I just want to get off this topic now. Yeah, that was, that made it weird. Let me yeah. ask y'all a question: <laughs> Have we all been in relationships, excluding Emro? I think so. Why excluding me? Because you don't. Because you've been in a me. relationship forever. Oh no! I, I thought he didn't believe in them. <laughs> I guess. Man. Um. Yeah. Whatever. But y'all talked uh, to a woman for a long period of time. I think so. What? Okay. Whatever. Ah, really? <laughs> talked like as in like the yeah you like you kind of like cuffing the guys like. Keep yeah, going. Just go on. Just go on. Get to your point. Keep, keep yeah, going I want to ask details. my question. Like, what's the grimiest shit a woman's done? To you? It really is what I want to know. What was the grimiest Ooh. shit a woman's done to you that you were interested in? But you don't even have to be. Like that, you don't even have to be in a serious like relationship. Okay, that fine. That's why. That's why I switched. It. That's why I said to you what, that you were interested in. Like, what's the grimiest oh, thing a woman's okay. done to you when you were interested in them? I don't know. That's a good. Nothing specifically. For me, it was one girl I was talking to, and she was getting real. And we were talking for a while. She was getting good. Mm-hmm. She she came like a, a strict Muslim out of nowhere. She started wearing a hijab. But <laughs> like, she started wearing a hijab, and I'm like, what the? It's fuck? funny guy know who he's talking about <laughs> now. Because you know, that actually hurt. <laughs> that shit hurt. That shit hurt. It. <laughs> that shit hurt it. Yeah, that shit. But most of the time, to be honest, most of the time. I blame it on myself because it's like I could I could have done this situation. Mind you, this, this is coming from a guy of Arabic. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like, more to it. I don't want to say Arabic. I was talking. But I'll say Middle Eastern. Things were going good. We were talking, and then she cut everybody off, including me. And then she she, she, did, she went cold turkey. <laughs> she she went cold turkey. Muslim went cold turkey. That's a grand. I, mean, I respect this. You you had to respect it. That's her culture. That's her. It wasn't for her culture. She did for herself. She was trying to better herself. Type shit. I feel like it's both. Maybe maybe she feels happiness. You know, we should get her on the pod. You know, um, facts. Trying. What about you? What was the most grimiest thing a woman's done to you? Man. I got a good one. Uh, I got many things. So you go first. Right. I've been <laughs> fucked. <laughs> this is the I one. What song? What's the song you were crying, crying to, listening to when, when no one was looking? That's a good question. What song I'm playing. That's a good question. Never cried <laughs> to a song. I cried. I, was like, I did kind of. I cried maybe in the inside. I've been crying, but I got. I definitely got some watery eyed listening to some like yeah. emotional music. You maybe listen, to, you listen to the right song. You think about some shit. You're like. Party next door, Sniffing. joy. Really? Um, that was my ex- that was me and my ex song. But let me get to my story. Let me get to my story. All right, the most grimiest thing we was at Old Westbury. I was only with one person at Old Westbury. Um, hey, we don't you don't know, my nigga, but that shit was yeah. awful. <laughs> that was an awful relationship, bro. I mean, it was good. For I think I know. No, outside, outside, outside looking in. in, edit, <laughs> outside, looking in. outside looking in, that shit looked great. The it's inside great. it was Y'all miserable. Like, good thing it's like a wrong no. Thing. <laughs> yeah. All right, all right, all right. But um, we had broken up. I think I don't even know But at this point Yeah I think we were broken up So I don't know why We ended up in the stairs Talking but we were talking And then I'm just gonna cut to Jason After you broke up? Yeah So she asked me She's like oh Are you going home this weekend? And I'm like Nah Why? I was like actually You know what? I don't wanna know that answer Cause it's just gonna hurt my feelings And she's like oh okay And I'm walking away And she's like oh Cause I got a nigga coming over <laughs> <laughs> Yo <laughs> Wait in your room? No, we were oh, on the no. stairs. And I just felt my heart. I was like, ah! 
but, but those are learning curves. Yo, those are learning that curves. shit made like, my oof. heart fucking oof. burn. That's rough. It, that is, that's some, no, that's she's a bitch. For that, no, bro. you know what happened? That's, that's some bitchy shit. No, you know what made it worse? I was um talking to one of um people oof. we know. Um, her name is Jay. You remember the, her first letter, Jay? Yeah, yeah, okay, I know. She didn't tell him. She's like, no. <laughs> that would game over. She was just messing with you. I was like, yo, what the fuck? That's, ah! Before you I don't sleep in some girl's bed, but before we you fuck. even got to that point, I was gonna tell you that. I, I didn't even know that. Yeah. And I already knew she was lying. That shit and then I fell for it, nigga. <laughs> because you literally set yourself up. You 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 literally No, I said I didn't wanna know. I said, no, nah, nah, I don't wanna know. That's what I'm saying. I, I don't wanna know. By you saying I don't wanna know, this shit's really gonna fuck I with me. She goes, know. thanks for the gun. Fact. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You she must really hate she, Yeah, no, I don't think she hated it. I think she was awful. just a manipulative or like a bitchy. I, I, that shit was no, awful, I think bro. She, 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 rock, she hates me now. I think I'm not going to be over it. Listen, girls I hope she's over it. It's been enough time. The, the most craziest shit. It'd be uh, the most man. minimalist shit, and girls be like, I want it. Let me hear this story. Your turn, bro. Your turn, bro. Yeah, I know yo. you got some shit deep down. That shit oh, hurt, my nigga. That's embarrassing, my nigga. Like, girls tell you, yo, I'm going to get my back pounded out. Like, <laughs> she about to, he about to layer my bricks. And I got to sit there and go back down to my room and just talk to my roommate, play some Halo. <laughs> That's what you gotta Bro, do. No you funny gotta go shit. Play a video game. No funny shit. I was wild depressed. Like, yeah. I mean, it's a learning curve, man. Yeah, man. Never really, do that ever again. Never. Really love that chick, man. When a girl, never really, uh, a girl that you have right. a roller coaster ride with, you yeah. don't go. Here's the gun. Shoot me. I've never really been done dirty. I took all her friends though, so I'm valid. I haven't really been done dirty though. <laughs> like, that wasn't really yeah. like a personal. No, they're all my friends now. <laughs> I've never really been done dirty. Except for cat because I, I fired. Know. I feel like it was just my fault, like some shit, some certain shit, and I was like, I don't know. Yeah. There's things that you could have never say never, man. Because I always, never I always say think never. it's like, yo, I could have handled it better. I could have done this. I yeah, not yet. You always gonna feel like that at the end of like uh, I never, I never had guy. nothing like that. Though. Bro, that, that was grimy. That was grimy, my nigga. That, that was grimy. grimy. Have you ever gotten anything ever? The grimy stories like I can that? tell like, you, man. Grimy, like I, I mean, obviously some shit happens, but like. The stories I could tell you, man. We gotta have a bonus episode. I heard a couple. I heard a couple. That's a bonus. I think you told me a couple. Yeah, I told you a few. I haven't even grazed the surface. <laughs> you know, Matt's <laughs> all of it. <laughs> oh, man. That's oh, like, man. Uh, man. It builds character, though. It puts hair on your nuts. It, it, yeah. it, it made does. me a better person. It, made me it a better does. Person. It yeah. does. Because now it's just never going to happen again. No, no, no. And no. even if it now does, I feel like I'm more uptight. Even if it uptight. does, it's like, if it does it's like your balls are bigger now, so you're not gonna be. If I'm gonna say that to you again, I'd be like, Yeah, my fist is a little bit harder. Like, oh, go fuck somebody else. Get the fuck out of here. Go fuck yeah. him. <laughs> it but it wouldn't get that far. Weird, like, yeah, it wouldn't like, get that far though. You wouldn't hear from me. I'm just like, all right, like, cool. I don't know, man. No I, problem. I think cool. we need to embrace. What's embrace, your friends doing? I think we need to fully embrace open relationships in 2020. No, I'm sensitive. Where Where do you think? What do you What do you think? Wait, hold on a second. You're not fucking escaping this. What? He's thinking. He's thinking. Let no, he's think. not. <laughs> to be fair, I, I actually was thinking because it was just a lot of shit. All right, well, <laughs> throw off one right and, now. And I don't have like a a, a, a moist story. It don't gotta be moist. <laughs> <laughs> don't gotta be moist. I don't, I don't have bread. a moist story. It could be what's, like what's bread. Song? What's your depression? What's your depression song? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, every nigga got a depression shit, song. Shit, I fucking cried. Bro. I think uh, I was so bad. Dude. I think yeah. I was some eight oh eight on heartbreak shit for me. For me, oh, I was some eight oh eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eight oh eight. I think it was. I don't know. Yo, mine was mine was heartless and lo- love locked down. How'd you have bounce back though? How'd you have bounce back? Say you will was mine. Don't say you will unless you will. Yo. I say you will. I remember I, I was thinking this shit in all West and I was in the tall <laughs> stall. I was thinking I was in my I was like say you will. You're crying while oh, shit. I was great, crying. I was it's a great, great song. It's, it's a song. great song. Wait, so so how did how did y'all bounce back from the cry? Just in general, I went like savage mode. <laughs> I went straight savage. Yeah, I think I was like go to nigga. Like, I caught the bus immediately. Bus. I caught um not or not. yeah immediately yeah <laughs> immediately. I, I got, cried for a few days. I got some of the best like some of the best bodies in my life at that that point. I was so was glad like, I got single in a Westbury. Wild, I was wilding. Oh rap. no, I was like next level wilding. Yeah. No, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm glad I be like that happened at Old West because I happened yeah, at yeah, home. Yeah, yeah. I would have killed myself. But I like, got them over real quick at yeah. OS. Yeah, like I wild out senior year, and that was a good year. It was a good year. Yeah, yeah you gotta you gotta bounce back. You just gotta be a savage for wild yeah, out. Yeah. I took my time, you know. I learned my body. Um, Cause you're like, oh, all these females are stupid. <laughs> That's yeah, 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 yeah. I, I took the back time. Back to my I misogynist started shit. You bugging, know? like started bugging. <laughs> nah, I just fell into the pussy. Like I wasn't even trying. Like it just fell into me. I was like, oh. this should be yes! fine. That's nice. When you get to that point, yeah, where you just get. Cause my game was rusty at that point. 
Yeah. Like, we now, don't even need to get my game was fantastic. I like after, after the fresh fresh I, off? After yeah. I got smoked. You had your apartment? I know your game was it was it was it was too much. When you have an apartment, Yo, it's he, easier when he had right his now. own fucking apartment, he was well we have our own apartment now, but before it's different it was, when you're by yourself by yourself. Yeah, he was by yeah. yourself by yourself. He was I know you was well, well, not not only that, I was just going through a stage where I was like, fuck it. Yeah. And I was going out like I, I I had worked at the bank and I would go out with my friend. I, uh, on a Sunday, yep. leave the club at five in the morning to go yeah. open up the bank at seven. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ! And that was like on a consistent basis. I, I would have burned downtown, down, downtown midtown, down. all the good clubs. I mean, to be honest, like, yeah, I could. You, you, I, would, I, would I would do that. Out. I would do that. Oh no, I'll, I, I'll burn out. But you sleep. You don't. You know. You sleep when you get home. I had so many errors. You were young. You we're young at the time. You were younger. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Now no. I mean, we're still I'm younger. Cold, yeah. I, I, I used to have girls. In, I, took me a while. I'm trying to take advantage of those times while I still can. But yeah, I would right. have to get back in shape. Like when I say in shape, like I like eat healthier. Oh yeah, yeah I so. can't. I'm not going. I'm not getting going somewhere until five a.m. I feel work. like shit, but I can do it still. I've done it. No. No. I don't know. It's rough. It's weird. I if think the I, opportunity is good enough. Like yeah, like Santa yeah, yeah, tomorrow. Yeah. Like if I had to work, I think I could do I'd that. Still yeah. get five. You know, I'd be like, fuck it. I gotta. Be, I gotta stay moving. The minute I sit down, it's clip for me. Like I. Yeah, for me, I've been falling asleep, ah, bro. Waking up early for work, that'd be fucking me up. Yeah, eat your vitamins, yeah. bro. Yeah, this is you. so sad. Like, well, this well, is I want to hear your, your apartment stories, though. I want to hear that solo. Fact, yeah. There yeah. was there, there was this one time we went to Midtown. We went to a really dope club, Avenue, right next to One Oak, and we, we had a we had the whole table because, okay, so you, you know how I am. I, I, I get cool with people and shit. Yeah, you socialize. You're very I socialize social. heavy. You're very social. And the bouncer really fucked with us. He was like, all right, 50 each to get in. And that's Wait, great. What? No, that's great for like the bougiest white oh, people club. Every tonight. table is at least $5,000. You couldn't get in without a table. Jesus fucking But Christ. this is the meaty part. The meaty part is we, we, we had three girls with us and then we went in and then we go in and then there was this yeah, Hispanic crazy. bouncer. He was like, yo, what's up? What's going on? And these guys just left the table. Mind you, they still had three vodkas on their table. So the, the bouncer goes, Go ahead, take the table. Like a ah. bottle or in a cup? Huh? Like in a bottle or in a cup? In a, in a no, bucket. In a bucket. In, in a, a bucket. bucket. I got to make sure. Like, I just want to show my man is not drinking vodka oh, nah. out of someone else's cup. Nah, like, nah. <laughs> oh, shit, you <laughs> got a bottle. You know, you know some people don't be like, people, they force you to get a couple bottles and some rich people, they don't, they're not drinking that shit. Yeah, they're not know. finishing two bottles of fucking Ciroc. Yeah, I'm so fine, not going to let people in now. <laughs> like, fuck it. Um, we had the whole table. There was at least fifteen girls and like yeah. four dudes of us. It was me. I, I, <laughs> uh, it was don't Brian. don't put all the names out there. Uh, it's all right. Well, for your, your Anyways, face? point is, we went back to my house, my apartment, and we had three girls with us, bro. They were both. They were all in in panties and bras. They were just dancing. Mm. We were so lit, and and it's wavy because it, it's not like. Oh, it's an orgy about to happen. It's just like it's cool. Vibe. It was just a vibe, and we were yeah. all cool. So it was just like I think I ended up. Yeah, I, I did. I ended, <laughs> I you know, ended fighting? up you know, did y'all all did y'all did taking or? down one? Yeah, no. So it was a orgy. Not one. <laughs> no, he could have, but he didn't. Uh, whatever. It is what it is. It, it is what it is. But they Damn, all slept bro. over my house. Like I had, I had two beds and a sofa. And there was one girl on the sofa. There was two girls on the other one, and I slept with one. I'm sorry, there was one girl on the other one and I slept with one. And that was a great Made it work. Yeah, that's why I can live. Sounds dope. That's a vibration, man. That's a vibration. I, I like how you still diverted your, your heartbreak story to that. But I was like, right. <laughs> nah, you know, it's funny if you didn't bring it up. I'm about to change the topic. It's not that serious. Uh, yeah. Quickly, it was just, I really like this girl. She was gorgeous. Gorgeous. Mm-hmm. Gorgeous girl. Always, gorgeous. always a girl. Always she was a really girl. nice. She was really nice. Super we we nice. had a good vibe. Um, but what happened was, I was too much of a nice guy at yeah. that time. Yeah, yeah. And oh, was, yeah, I was a bitch. I've been. I have. The, I have that story. It, too, but, it, it wasn't working. Too, yeah. She. She was just like. She didn't even know how to explain to me how, why she like steered away from me because she knows that it was. It was yeah, perfect. Yeah, yeah. I mean, anything she wanted happened, and then you just can't do that. Ah, that and, nice yeah. guy shit is the worst, bro. I, yeah, that I, shit's I, was, ass, I had, bro. You gotta be a little bit of a dick guy. She I immediately fucked some other dude, like immediately, and they 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 went on, and that shit hurt. You know, my first you know who, bro? It was this one girl I fumbled, bro. She was dumb bad. Yeah. I know. And she was, she basically, like, I made out with her and everything. She was, it was like, it was about to happen. Like, it was in the bag. Yeah. And then I, st- I still fumbled it because I was still on that nice guy. And when that you nice say, like, oh, I need consent. 
Yeah, she was. That nice guy nonsense. I was just not calm. I, was, I wasn't confident enough to just like snap Go it up. For it, it was man. like yeah. it was. It would have been easy. You live and you learn, was, yo. Was, you live and you learn. That's yeah. all you can say. That's why. Like, that's why I didn't mention that. Niggas need to start cool. talking about the, the the bags they fumbled instead of hiding and acting like they always get bitches. Like it's okay. Yeah, to but be like, I, was, I, I learned. I learned a lot from that though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. those are the ones you. A lot of a lot of dudes out here, you know, make it seem like they're elite. Yeah, it's okay to like, yo, she didn't want you, nigga. It's alright. Anytime I share stories, I let dudes know. I'm like, yo, listen, I'm not that. Every great. success story comes with like six failure stories, right? right. Like, like, I felt heavy. Like, it's alright to be like, yo, I sense. walked up to her and she said, no, you're not the only nigga that talked to her today. You are the 85th. She's tired. Now. It does get frustrating. Mm-hmm. It's, it's you know, okay, it buddy. Even LeBron lost the majority of time. Yeah. In the or you said some fuck shit. <laughs> you said some dumb shit. Still not better often. often. Yeah. Nigga, yeah, no, yeah. I don't come here often. What the fuck? Don't ask me. Like, it's okay as a man to be like, yo, like, I fumbled the bag it's, on this one. It's because nowadays, nowadays. Niggas worry about other niggas' dicks. N- in this digital uh, world, we, we don't even know how to approach f- females. No, it's not. No, I'm talking about when niggas approach a woman and they get dubbed. They go to their man's like, oh, that bitch was whack. That has nothing to do with social media. That's your ego. I'm not saying social media. I'm, I'm saying the, the whole digital world. Even then, but what does that have to do with you saying you a bitch is whack? Approach, you don't know how to approach a girl like but, you don't know. But, but let me explain it to you. You can approach a girl in the right way, and she can still dub you. Yeah. I'm talking about the after effect. But let me explain to you okay. why. Okay. The, 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 the problem is that we're so used to getting what we want and yeah. instantaneous um, gratification that when a girl dubs you know, a dude, he's like... Damn, I didn't get what I want. In reality, it's yeah. I didn't get what I want. I'm not as elite as I thought I was. <laughs> and mm-hmm. so he goes he back to his boys because he don't want to look corny. Yeah. Damn, yeah, that I mean, chick was whack. She was whack. She, 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 she wasn't. Hey, how's your walk away like when a girl dub you? Because my shit's hilarious. <laughs> you didn't fix yours. You used to be good. <laughs> Mine's good. What are you talking about? Nah, you 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 messed up like once or. Like, yeah, like, so like, like you mess oh, up like out, out. out. Speaking to the mic, speaking to the mic. Out. You, you mess up like one or two times, but not, not mm-hmm. OD. Is walk away? I'm talking about like after like, she says here's no. Here's my like, thing. I'll walk away if I'm not interested anymore. If like, if no, I'm, I'm, I get turned off. I'm talking about like, she dubs to, you. What's your walk away? Like mine, when I get dubbed, my walk away, I do a goofy ass smile. I'm like, <laughs> 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 like, you know, <laughs> Like sometimes I just be smiling, like, All right. bro, that is hilarious. It's <laughs> like the Kirby enthusiasm song was playing in the background. <laughs> you know what mine is? I'm just sitting there, like, <laughs> you know what mine is? I pretend to see someone I know. I'll be like, there he is. Yo, what's going on? Yeah, play it on, man. You know what I'm saying? play it on. Like, all right, like you, you to her, you're like, all right, yo, that's cool, whatever. Same you walk this. away. But when you turn your back, that's what I'm saying. Like from that point on, what's your walk away? Like I said, I like, think I talked about it once. So I have a one smooth move where I, where mm-hmm. I try to pull up to the girl. You know, you, you, you tap on the waist real quick. Yeah. And she does your shit. You act like she's pushing her out the way. Like, oh, I'm um. trying to get this crowd. <laughs> <laughs> like, you gotta give her the mean step. Like, this. oh no, <sighs> no, I was trying to talk to you. Can you get the fuck out the way? Like, yeah, <laughs> like, yo, not everybody wants you, bitch. Like, nah, I'm not gonna lie to you. My, my, well, my walk away is like, all right, cool. I apologize. I, you know. I all right, now when you turn your back and you. But, walk your bro. I, I've messed up a couple times mm-hmm. where th- there was this one time I was walking through the club and I saw a girl and I was like, oh, she, she's valid. And I, I said something. I was walking through the crowd as well. So I was trying to like multitask. Yeah. So that's I, the easiest way to do it. That's right. Because like, the lowest <laughs> effort. Because you, you know, you're telling like, you just, you yeah, just in like, case. OC. Wow, man, I don't want to mention OC, but he's the king of that shit <laughs> king, in general. King, king of that shit. King. He's the king of the. Crown him. He's the king of the. Just the, hey, he'll touch you with it. Did you die to it? Fuck it. He'll shoot your shot with every girl in line. <laughs> <laughs> Go one by one. Like, excuse me, tap you on the shoulder. Like, <laughs> it's a great strategy. He's just, uh, you know, it's volume, bro. He's the mellow of this shit. He, he'll shoot fifty shots. It don't matter, bro. As long as he makes a couple. <laughs> it's a great strategy. I actually that is hilarious. It's actually really oh, good. Man, man. Just volume oh. shooting. Like. Volume shooting. Are but, you are you a volume shooter? Sometimes. Sometimes I, I'm I, I don't think that. you don't seem like a volume shooter. Shit. It depends on my day. Yo, it really depends. I'm, if if I see something I really want, nothing gonna sound because I know yo. If I fumble that bag. I can't let every other woman in there know I fumbled the baddest chick in the room nah, bag. No, it's not. Mm, it's not the case. Nah, sometimes you gotta strategically because play you, things. Like you know why? Because they actually gonna see that you have confidence. So yes, it's not the confidence. Yes, it's it just is. like it no. I don't want them to know I tried to talk to her and then now I'm trying to talk to you. Because like oh like I'm the you my alternate bitch. But the fact that you had the biggest balls to go to the baddest because every other girl in there first of mm-hmm. all are already competing with themselves. Yeah. I, I, Listen, man. I'm like, these girls yeah, too much sometimes I'm a volume, security, sometimes yeah. I'm not. Yeah, sometimes I'm one. Oh, oh, 
oh, that chick is bad. Yeah. Well, like, they think chicks are bad, too. So if you go to a girl and you know you guys, what if she curves you? It's not gonna be if they see them, if you see if they see you get curved, it's not gonna be different. So it's about to do that awkward it's smile. It's 50 sometimes. <laughs> it's 50 50 because she the 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 whack chick wants to feel as powerful as the bad chick. So it might go 50 50. It mm-hmm. might go your way, and that might not. They might yeah, want to dub you more because like, oh, she dubbed him. I'm just as good as her, so I'm gonna dub him. It's, yeah. Exactly. It's big. Is she she's trying to boost up her confidence? Now. I don't even know. You man. ever got dubbed by an ugly girl? Yes. Yeah, a hundred really? times. That shit really Hundreds hurt. Of times. Like you lowered your level to her. You know what like, fucked uh, up? <laughs> that should make you want to kick her. Like <laughs> you know, be some 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 spots, some some bars Sport you're in. Yeah, so, like, some bars you're in. All the all the like the sexy girls for some reason. All the cute girls they're not with, they're not with the shits at all. So all the rate? ugly girls get all the love, and the ugly girls we feel like they that bitch. Cause every single nigga be Sometimes you gotta up. slide that out. This sounds so fucked up. Sometimes you gotta slide that in. We talking about yo, you a little ugly, but I'm bored. <laughs> what? Oh no! I never worked. I was making a joke. I was making a joke. I, I tell him all the time. Something like it. it happened to me in White Plains, uh, and we kicked it off smoothly. You a little ugly, but I'm bored. No, I didn't do that. It was worse. You got some crust on your worse. mouth. It was worse because it was, it was in the front of cr- it was a crowd of dudes, and, and we were all duding or yeah, doing what duding. men do. And th- there were like three girls next to me. I, I tell you a story, and like one of them was like, "Yo, I dare you say something to them," and I was like. <laughs> They heard me. I started laughing and chuckling. And I was like, these girls, these girls are so trash. Mm. I fuck girls way better looking than them. See. They immediately heard that. And they're like, and you think you all that? I will never forget this. Shout and then I said, no listen, I don't think I'm the best thing, best looking thing in the world. But I fuck girls 10 times better than y'all. Oh, that's not It nice. stung. Yeah, bro. Yeah, and I don't know nice. what happened. I'm not going to lie. You're not coming off likable right now. <laughs> <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Misogyny. 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 I, I, Misogyny. I, I, Misogyny. I, I forgot a, what Oscar, happened. Oscar couldn't be on this episode this week. He's completely missing this week. Yeah. Hold on. I, I forgot what happened. Am I it? Completely replaceable. <laughs> we... we <laughs> We started to Yo, he doesn't know my track record. I'm one for one on fire. <laughs> Come on, man. You know, you know the fucking vibes. Yeah, you're fire, dude. Listen, oh, we, we started kicking it. They they started liking me. They were like, Yo, you, you're mad cool. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's hang out in the city. And See then us. then we you started the, kicking it. You out there with the lazy eye bitch? <laughs> no, she, like, so what do you like to do for fun? They're fucking beautiful. So. Oh, you're that's, just, that's that's just a shit. Yeah, that's a, you're just a shithead. Yeah. Holy God. shit, man. Fuck. So, Speaking of beautiful, ugly women. Let's talk about Lizzo. Let's talk about Lizzo. <laughs> Would you fuck Lizzo? Number one. Before I say nah, because she's annoying. Who the fuck is Lizzo? She looks good, but she she's annoying. She's kind of annoying, yeah. She she's has, just annoying. Like She actually looks good, my nigga. I just don't like that fat girl confidence. Like, what why are you what? confident? Wait, okay. Go Ew. deeper into this. What? You know that fat girl confidence? No. I'm not a fan. I don't know what that is. You know where a girl's like she's just, she's, she's ugly. just happy like because she's fat. Like you know, uh, we were just an ugly, confident this. chick, an ugly girl that's confident. Oh, it's the same thing, but you're fat. No, it doesn't have to be fat. It's just, she's girl? not. No. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There's no. better pictures of her. No. You wanna fuck? No. I probably fuck. I don't know. I don't know if I would fuck, but she looks good in my opinion. Because she she passed my radar to fuck. She's too big. I mean, whatever. I, I, got, I got a very low bar I, for who I'm willing to fuck. Chicks. I have a very low bar. She's too big. It's different. I'll be honest. <laughs> Bro, I, I, I don't know if you're like this too. You fucking Mrs. Fuck, Claus. He loves fat chicks. Nah, I don't love him. Call me Mrs. Claus. There's nothing wrong. Some bitch. Oh yeah, I fuck the shit out of some. Not some, wrong. Not oh, even uh, fat. This bitch is not, kind of hot. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, she looked doughy. Her hair looks you know, great. She looked like a fucking cookie dough. She looked like uh, Pillsbury. The Michelin, Michelin man. Oh, like, I fucked uh, the shit out of ex-wife or something. I fucked the shit out of Michelin man. <laughs> oh, he's a man. <laughs> Michelin woman. <laughs> He's not a man. He's an inanimate object, bro. It's not gay. So go back. <laughs> retract, retract, retract. I fucked the shit out of his sister. Wait a second. <laughs> what if that's the LGBTQ's mascot? Lizzo? No. Oh, Michelin Man. The Michelin Man. <laughs> Shit. Because it's an inanimate object and transgenders mm. are Lizzo, not. I appreciate you trying to hook to They're hook. like, they're not inanimate objects, but the they Michelin don't identify. Woman. Well, transgenders identify. There's a group that doesn't identify. So what if it's the non-identification you know what? Fuck all I know is the Michelin Man's girl is probably thick as hell. That's all I know. What if it wasn't? Curvy. What if she was a flat tire? Damn, bro. You really we dead like, don't know. That's smart. <laughs> you know what's my fear? My fear is, uh, you know, having sex with girls like that large. It's like, what is it going to smell like? Like I mean, pussy? These, these girls be taking care of The skinny bitches that stink. Mm. 
You don't think there's skinny women that stink? Of course. Okay, then. There's some fat bitches that smell good. But there's statistics to this shit, too. There's no, anal- <laughs> there's no analytics. Got studies. There's yeah, no analytics. advanced analytics to this nigga. Like, like, they got advanced analytics the, for fat chicks. My point like, is, the worst place that a skinny chick is... What's her ROI? Is her ass... What's her return on investment? Yeah. Come <laughs> on, oh, man. The five minutes of sex you will have with me. Yeah, but mm. you also have to sweat. That's Because the sweat will make the pussy wet. <laughs> hey, let's end this shit. <laughs> I'm done. I'm going go is home. It, already? Is the pussy no. really wet? Oh. <laughs> nah. So We're like an more. hour in, I think. I don't fucking We're know. We're an hour in already? God damn. Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's been an hour. Let me actually check. So, flu. Dude, I'm on. I just minutes. drew a breeze. On this is not sponsored by Monster, but this is what I drink. And mm-hmm. we also have no, Bombay no, Gin. No, no, no. Yeah, no. And we um, don't sponsor it. Let's either. actually really talk and about Lizzo. we got Lizzo. on let's the as well. Let's really talk about Lizzo right now. So, she decided to go to the Staples Center in a Hanes t shirt with the ass cut out. Yeah. That's a fit. That is not a fit. That's it's a, a Hanes t shirt. My nigga, she's not even wearing a Hanes. That's what gets me tight. She's wearing a Gildan. <laughs> bro, <laughs> you know how disappointing it is like, that you wore a Gildan? Triple X Gildan. Yeah, a, Gildan. a Triple X Gildan. It looked like a Gildan. It had the fabric um look like a Gildan. I don't like Hanes anymore. Yeah, she didn't even like. But Hanes is better than Gildan. Gildan is like. If you gotta wear ass, like, ass putting starch ass on your, ass your ass clothes. Or some like mesh fire shit. Yeah, you know, she could have worn nice Fashion dress. Nova and she wore Gildan. Nah, she, wore, she just wore uh, a. You know what she did? She did what every college girl does her freshman year when they cut the bottom of their shirt for pep rally. Except she just like just wore, made a hole for ass. Yeah, and it's like, yo, my nigga, you're mad lazy. I don't and know, what makes it even more dirty is she sat on one of those seats. Like I know her yeah, ass got a pimple. There's nothing worse than a confident ugly girl. I don't mind you being <laughs> confident and ugly. I mean, I'm ugly, but I just mind you being stupid. I'm not like loud. That was stupid. I say I'm she did it for attention. That's what got me tight. It was like, I yo, like this listen. didn't even make Who sense. Who doesn't do things for attention? It I just I didn't like it. It was like, yo, it was a bad fit. I fuck the shit out of Liz. I don't care. Slay, slay cool. queen, slay queen. You yeah, know? she's cute. I yeah. fuck her if but I that was a bad her for move. Like five days, I'll be like, you know what? You are fuckable on that as well. Yeah, it's like you know what? Why not? Why, why not? not? Yeah, it's one of those. Not? You know what? Why not? But yeah. it's not something where like I'm 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 excited about the fact that she's around me. You know? Do you have high standards to people you fuck? Yes. Really? Good why? bodies only. Why? If I'm covered, I'm not a nigger. standard, but you're you know. bugging. The fuck. The fuck, are you talking? about? do you have such a strong standard, bro? Yo, nah, open no weak mind. bodies, open no weak mind. bodies. I don't know. I feel like I feel like I probably have one weak body. That was the girl that <laughs> really? sucked out the niggas dick in my bed. Really? No, oh, yeah, she was a weak body. That was a weak. Body. I got more weak bodies than you, then. Yeah, sure. Bro. I don't even have a lot of bodies. You know what I like about the weak bodies? I have like ten. You're a nice guy. You know what I like? I have like ten. No, I'm picky. You know, you know what I like about? And I max out credit cards. You know what I like about <laughs> the ugly... fucking vibes? <laughs> you know the vibes. <laughs> you know what I like about fucking ugly girls though? What? Is that now I'm at the point they sound where like I shirt? appreciate where I'm fucking ugly girl. It makes no difference whether she's bad or ugly. She's just I'm fucking you know. It's like uh, I'm at the point where it's like exactly, bro. Sex exactly. is a beautiful. Sex where it's is a like I'm just thing, like a, it's, you're all the same. Like is it, you're at that point where exactly. It's like yeah, you're prettier to look at, but at the end of the day, like it's, you, it's the same feeling. You, you, know? you, you, you know what they say? Like it's not a saying, but it's not the it, same. Obviously, well, you appreciate it more, but no, no, it's 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 not a saying. But they tell you. You know, you could start with like fat and ugly chicks and watch you, you know, you know, increase. And that's exactly what happened to me. I started with like, eh, you start knocking chicks. down some fours. You gonna? Okay. Yeah, I ended up like knocking down tens because in reality, it you, is mm-hmm. all the same. I've never like, knocked down a four. No, not on four. No, I've not done like a four or five. What would you rate her? Five and a half. She's. I'm gonna give her a four because she sucks another nigga's dick. She's a gorgeous, ugly bitch. I'm gonna give her a four because she sucks another nigga's dick. So she's like a ten. She's a ten out of thirty. So she oh oh so okay. she's she's a three point three. Out of ten. Yeah, three point three. Out of ten. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nah, it depends. We have a different. Me and him have a different rating system. Yeah, we have a different rating system. Let me break down his rating system. Yeah. So there's three, oh, should we got a picture? There's of her. three tiers. There's three tiers. There's zero to ten, which is strictly for ugly bitches. There's ten to twenty, which is strictly punch you. 10 for 20 strictly, strictly for average bitches yeah, and then there's there's 20 to 30 which is for gorgeous bitches if you're a 10 you're a gorgeous ugly bitch mm-hmm. if you're a, a 20 you're a gorgeous average bitch I'm gonna cancel this podcast if you're a 21 you're a hideous gorgeous bitch very simple you, but you know what I'm talking about you see a girl like 
She's gorgeous. You know what pisses me off about this that is that sense. you could no, you could have <laughs> reduced the number from zero. That's literally the scale of zero to ten, essentially. Because no, because zero. I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Too yeah. Too but that's a lot of you numbers. You use decimals, but niggas didn't go to class, so you don't really learn math. <laughs> but that's <laughs> the value. You use decimals. It's it's what the, it's getting me agitated is that the value of everything. It's. It just gets diluted. I, I, I just like, like the tier. I just like having that's the tiers. Exactly. So why don't you say tier one, two, and two, and tier three? But there's levels in the tier too because you could be the top level of the tier. Or you could be the you bottom don't level of the tier. Unless you want to do it at sixty, you do it at sixty. You, you do it at sixty. You do have to. You know why? Not go out of hundred. It from zero yeah. to like ten. Like actual grading sorry. system. It's a dramatic constraint. Would you go A B C D? It's a dramatic constraint from mm-hmm. zero to ten. That means I can re- in reality mean. Why don't you just do a letter grade? Mm, I don't like that. No, That's 26 it's, it's characters. Just, I need 30. No, I'm talking about the you, actual school's letter grade. No, we don't like A, because, A minus, B, B nah, minus. Because in our tier system, enough. by which number, by which number he says, I know exactly what he's talking about. He says 31. I'm like, oh, she's a gorgeous bitch, but there's something, there's like one detail about her that doesn't make her perfect. Or like her nose a little fucked up. Like her nose might be a little gorgeous. funky, but she's probably gorgeous. Yeah, mm. like, like amongst gorgeous girls, she's ugly, but by, by amongst average girls, she's gorgeous. You know, like that type of thing, you know? Ella retarded. System, you know? Hey, man, you know it, it works. It works. It works. Like, like Lizzo. Lizzo is, is probably a gorgeous girl. I say 10. Bitch. 22. She's gorgeous for him. She's, She's a 10. 10. She's a 10. She's, a She's 10. gorgeous for an ugly girl. She's not ugly. Okay, or she's 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 tier two. She'll be like she's fourteen. Two, she's she's then then she'll be out of fourteen. Fourteen. So she's a below 15. average average girl. I'm gonna give her fifteen. <laughs> Let go. I'm gonna give her fifteen. So she's an average 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 girl. She's yeah. Triple average. Triple average. Triple average right there. See, you fuck with Siri. No. Like, See? It makes sense. It makes no, sense. No, 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 no. This is all I'm about to say. Can you said triple average? <laughs> you mean double average. Triple XL. <laughs> oh, that's why. <laughs> that's why I, I was trying not to say it. I was like, oh, like her oh. weight. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to fuck with sad bitches, though. Um, but I think Lizzo looks good. Uh, I don't know. Yo. I don't want to give them that to go ahead. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to give her that. I no, think she's a 14. She's mobilizing all these fat girls to think they're cute. I don't want that to happen. Yeah. <laughs> That's a little bit too much arrogance and ego like slay for no queen, but not really though. <laughs> you can slay, but like fat chicks yeah, were were, were, were <laughs> created. <laughs> you mean? Oh my fucking god! <laughs> What's the next stop? For more love, yo, Chase. All right, yo. This is something I really did was I was running off on a tangent, but the year is ending. Um, I really want to wait, but I don't really give a fuck anymore. Um. We gotta end that word. Um, it, it, it's a new decade, so we gotta end the word. You know the vibes and the vibrations, but that's really fucking hard because what do we say to express our excitement and our excitement in a woman? Because you could tell a woman she's a vibe and she's mm-hmm. gonna fucking go crazy. So I've been thinking about this shit for the decade, and I'm thinking like something like universe, like galactic, like yo, like okay, so we're brainstorming. My galactic is crazy, like um, okay. what what is that thing? Um, you the essence, <laughs> the essence. No, Ooh. the essence is pretty cool. Girl, though. I, fuck that. I like that one. Yo, I thought with the essence in here. Damn, Damn. give me some space that, shit. Yo, what? The essence oh, in I'm here. definitely saying that. Girl, what? yo, you're my whole essence. I swear. Uh, what's shoot. that? She's soaking from here. In this what's place. that thing? Big Bang. Um, that's what I'm thinking of. Big Bang. Um. So like when shit's lit, it's like, yo, this is Big Bang. Okay. It's too much. Nah. I'm no, not for a girl, just in general. Yo, yo this is Big Bang. Wordy. You know my Big Bang? It's too wordy. Nah, it's that too sounds much. nasty. It's too wordy. It's too wordy. Nah. You need lit. You need like Mickey, three like Milky quick, Way. Lit. You need you need a that's quick like milky. instant one. Milky? No, that's just little that gross. shit kind of sucks. That sounds yeah. That sounds sucks. <laughs> milky Way. Damn, bro, you yeah. Milky too. Bro, you know my shit. cosmic imbalance. Bro, we have this party where I said you're Milky as hell. Is that? Oh, cosmic. It's cosmic. just cosmic. Yo, that shit cosmic. Yeah, that shit cosmic. Nah, you sound Yo, like you're some, mad cosmic, man. You sound like some some eight eye motherfucker. Vanessa, my, my third eye. Vanessa. <laughs> nah. Oh, shit, I'm screaming into my. Oh, I'm sorry. We we're calling our um our maid. consultant. Vanessa. She's our Spanish yeah. maid. No. <laughs> Damn. I'm sorry. I, I wanted to try my move on her to see if it worked. Spanish maids clean. Just say the it. Best. Also, just tell her that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Her, uh, Is she coming? She's coming. She's Yo, coming? come here. Come here. And our Spanish maid is coming in. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. No, say, say, say. She's like, hola, you right. see guys. So I'm flirting with you, right? You know, I'm talking to you, about a bing, bada boom. No, I gotta. Are you wearing a Santa hat? All right, yeah, just, just, Santa just walk hat. in again. Hold on. Just, yeah, just, hold on. Just, just walk in again. Yeah, I'm gonna flirt with you. Watch, watch, watch. Check this vibe out. <clears throat> no, you. La la la. Yo, hey, how you doing? What's your name? Oh. What's your name? <laughs> Uh, nice okay. to meet you, Susan. My name is Tyler. Um, I just want to say you're real cosmic. Like, I like, <laughs> yeah. That's actually works. real interesting. How does that sound? Cosmic. 
Now I'm seeing the how role does that, play. Like, I, what, how does what, that sound? What, what, that shit probably works. Fuck, that shit probably I'm, works. <laughs> but wait, <laughs> I'm looking I can't at the say it's her own work because that's weird. We, I have to talk to her for Damn, a minute. All right, that should be... Yeah, like, Dude, we, I have we, to talk to you for a minute and then say it like, yo, like, you're real cosmic. Wait, 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 that was, that was swag sauce. Swag wait, sauce, swag sauce, swag sauce. Swag sauce. Absolutely. Yeah. I was skeptical, but I'm like, but the role yo, you're play real helped. Yeah. Thank you, Maria. Damn, that shit was... <laughs> Name was Sarah. I was skeptical. I was skeptical, but then yeah. you used it. I'm like, because you know why she's going to think like, oh, shit, he probably knows a lot about stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. He reads books. Oh, oh shit. Like, he knows like... about astronomy. Mm. Oh, shit. And, and our astrological... I don't know. Chemical um, imbalance. Chemical Mercury's in retrograde and my pussy's Vibes. soaking. Fuck me. Like some shit like that. <laughs> like he's probably gonna look at a star and just mm-hmm. just tell me about that star. Yo, you wild dipper. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds ridiculous. That sounds like some Bay Area dance. Do huh? the dipper. <laughs> yeah, that shit just dipper. starts. How do you know about <laughs> doing the dipper? <laughs> <laughs> I fucked your bitch because I'm Dipper. Nah, but <laughs> I'll actually be a dope ass. And then we do it. Fuck your bitch because I'm Big Dipper. Dipper. Big Dipper. No one has Big Dipper. That. Call me Big Dipper. No one has thought Big about Dipper. That. I'm a big tipper. Hey. When I see it, I'm a go slipper. Hey, pill in uh. a drink. Psych. Nah, we don't do that. Wait, Dipper. you look at me like you do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you was talking about putting pills. I said, drink. Psych. We don't do that. You went, huh? <laughs> Watch when I edit this. I'm gonna keyframe it to your face, and you gonna see my oh shit. When, remember when, when Rick Ross yeah, said, "Yeah, Molly and the Champagne." I thought about this the other know. day. I'm like, "Yo, that's wild." He didn't get canceled for that. Yo, he, they he tried to skate it around that. They way. tried to, yeah. but yo, he should have got canceled for that. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck. Wait, so are we settled on this cosmic, cosmic? But but cosmic to me is not. Good, give me a second. It's not you equivalent can, to lit. No, you're or only you know saying nah, that. You, you no, you're only saying it's a can't. female. That's the one you say to like. Oh, you, okay, yeah. Like yeah. I can say, yo, a female's a vibe. This is that version of I'm talking to a woman. I'm like, yo, you're mad cosmic. Yo, yo, but, but swing it again. So swing it again. How, how, like you're talking to. Let's say you really. No, feeling, how did you say it? How did you say it? Like yo, you're mad cosmic. Nah. Well, I said it's smoother. I'm talking, it I'm talking to a woman. You're gonna get one of either two reactions. Either she's gonna be curious. But that's she's good though. Because you get curious, you break it down. You break down the science. Or she's gonna be like, this is a fuck boy. No, fuck. No. I'm gonna try it tomorrow. I can see it. You can see that. I Watch. I'm gonna try it tomorrow. Cosmic. I'm gonna try it tomorrow. I'm like, yo, your energy's mad cosmic. That just got that's me hard. Nice level. That right. just got me so hard. Like it, though. I need to see the She gotta be a girl that's into like horoscopes. And shit. No, every she's girl's gotta horoscope. be like she's, every girl's into horoscopes. She, it's a what? shame. Right. Yeah, it's a it's shame. Yo, you're wild I, Sagittarius. I hate you basic bitches for that, but yeah, <laughs> it's all of them. It's all I'm all telling you, watch. All you gotta do is throw like, talk, but you can't say it immediately. You say it immediately, you're gonna look yo, you're Talk to her for a minute, like whatever you feel like is a appropriate time. After a while, you like, yo, I'm, I'm gonna be real with you. Like, yeah, your energy's really cosmic. I just like how your aura just spews out of you. And she Yo, is going that, to feel now crazy. Now that I'm thinking about it, don't it was, say it in a bar though. That's weird. No, not no, that's fine in a bar. Okay, it depends. Bars are so bars are. So depends so depends on the type of bar that's vibe. The line you drop at a girl and walk away, like, "Yo, you mad cosmic?" Walk away. She'd be like, "What? She'd be like, what just happened?" I, what? <laughs> I think you could use it in both senses. How you said, "Yo, we need, we need, we need you to follow up." If we want to hear, I'm gonna try it tomorrow. I hope I remember it like word by word. Because like, imagine you're mad you just cosmic, conversing like, with her and I don't know you just stop and you just go, hey, you're mad cosmic. Yeah, and you got to look at her that like you're serious, brutal. but you're not. Yeah. You got to look her in the eyes, too. You gotta yeah, like, you have yo, to look at her. No, There's a bunch no, of words no, I want to bring up this year, cosmic. man. To 2020, I'm using, like, when I don't like something, I'm going to say it's not my preferred settings. Like, <laughs> 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 like nah. Say something Say something crazy to me. Say something crazy. Like, yo, do you like this? Like, say something crazy to me. Why? Yo, bro, you ever watched the new fucking the Chicks Tape 4 or whatever? Nah, that's not my preferred settings. All right. Well, that doesn't count because you said something. Do you like bananas uh, in your asshole? That's perfect. Nah, that's not my preferred settings. Mm. You said like. Because think about it. On your phone, you have preferred settings that you like. Oh yeah, we get it. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for explaining it to us. No, no problem. We didn't no know. Problem. Preferred. I feel like y'all gonna be saying that shit too, and then you're like, oh shit. I'm, right. shit. Right, it's watch. It's I'm gonna say it around you every day. It's, it's too lengthy. It's too lengthy. lengthy. Yeah, it's but it sounds swaggy. Think about. Imagine hearing that shit at a radio interview. Swag fell off hard. You can't be saying yo swag. Oh no, you can't say that. Nah. It's more like sauce. Yeah. You can't be like, yo, that shit was swagged out. Drip got an uh, end. I'm done with that shit. Drip got an end. And no cap. I, I, I didn't never even like when it started. I, I hate no I cap. Like, Damn, you see my drip? Like, I like getting rap songs. Do you know my drip? 
And the rap song is is is, is catchy. Yeah, Did cool. you see the drip? Yeah, it fell off because I'm sick of I'm dripping like a faucet. Yeah. Some shit like no that, cap, got to end, bro. I'm so tired of that shit. I'm cool with that. No nah, cap. no cap. No bap. No. Cap. I didn't even understand that. I thought that meant like you had like no cap on how much you spend. That's when pe- people play. Like, I thought too you much could spend mad shit. They, they saw that they didn't have enough cap room. <laughs> got Kevin Durant in the free agency, so they just decided to add that into their workplace. Yeah. And if you have no cap, wouldn't that be a bad thing? Because, like, you can't close up your soda bottle. That's what I thought every time a person said no cap. You see where I'm going? Like, you I see said, how I'm doing so the math? where do you put the cap to that's your soda cap. bottle? Someone could say that's cap, too. They ain't lying. Man, you mean Colin Kaepernick? Niggas is stupid. <laughs> yeah, that's Colin Kaepernick. <laughs> that's kneeling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You yeah. know I was gonna kneel before my presentation just cause you're a fuck. <laughs> I mean I'm not mad at it, but you're a fuck. <laughs> no, just to be a dick. It yeah, had no I'm saying, like, you're a fuck. <laughs> Zero oh significance. Oh my god. Yeah, is there anything I want to talk about? <laughs> Yo, you know what's funny is at your fucking school they would have ate, 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 ate that shit up too. They would have been like, damn, he's super. He's, he's doing it with a purpose. And I have an afro, so they would have been like, oh, shit. You should have picked that shit out. He's so wild. cosmic right now. He's so yeah, cosmic. cosmic. What was the other word? Cosmic and, and preferred you, setting. You said aura? aura. Oh no, the aura. aura? I can no, feel no, your you aura oozing out. Essence. Essence. Bro, yo. Essence so is crazy. So, so you said to a black woman. Girl, yo, something about your essence. Something about your essence is just fucked up. <laughs> it's just driving me oh, towards you. I want to talk about something real quick. And I'm about to, I'm my bad for changing the tone. I was just thinking about this earlier. Um I see why black women are mad at white women when they um wear braids and shit. I saw this white woman named Yes Jules. She was wearing braids. I know Yes Jules. She's she's not you saw a porno? She, she's Hispanic. And yes, you know? Oh, I thought she was black. <laughs> yes, I did. But everybody was like, she's not black. I, saw, but I thought she was black. I saw her quote unquote porno at least, I'm not even dragging it, 20 times. Can you pull it up? Cause well, not now. I just want to see it. I didn't know she did a porno. She's loud. She good, she's though. Like a she didn't do a porno. What happened was there was this club. You, no, you, she did a porno. You, I watched it. I Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Something was beating it from the back, bro. I want to show you. Then, bro, you missed the porn. The, the bro, I was trying to say something one? important, and we got the porn. It's a nigga hitting it from the back. Yes, yes. The leaked one. That's not a porno. That's messed up. It's a. It was a porno for them. Yeah, and he leaked. But it. he he. It's I revenge. know he leaked it. That's revenge a sex porn. tape. That's a sex tape. It's That's a leaked tape. sex tape. But that wasn't the fucking point I of what I was trying to say. She's the so point hot. I was trying to say is I understand the frustration of a black woman because when I saw her wear those braids, I thought that was just a light skinned black woman. And I was like, damn, she looked fine. And everybody's like, yo, that's not a black woman. You have a now, problem with that, though? I don't have a problem, but I see the frustration. It's like a white woman that could do it. The cultural appropriation thing is a little stupid. I don't, no, 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 no. It's not. That. Because when a white woman does certain things, it's trendy. When a black woman... They literally had to make a fucking law yeah, in New York. Yeah, that's her fault. She didn't wear braids. Like. No, but I'm, no, listen to what I'm saying. They literally just made a, a law that said you cannot tell someone how to wear their certain hair. And it was really only directed towards black women. Because black you, women wear certain things to work. And yeah, they that's would fair. get fired that's fair, for though, because But when a white woman does it They would be like yeah. Oh yeah this looks well, good because we're a whitewashed culture And yeah. shit is coming to normal. But no that's what I'm saying and, I see and, the frustration black, with black women And it's black kids that go to school With afros yeah. And they'd be like Oh your hair is improper type shit you Exactly get a so, and That's what I'm saying I see the frustration with no, black, black women in, Not in New York But part of like areas Different parts of the country Probably not as much in New York But like not a city at least It doesn't happen in the city Because You know We're progressive And we're past that shit Well no And we have a higher People Get on the train later And let see White, white, white people in the city are used to seeing black people. That's what I'm saying. They still do the fuck shit, though. No, no, no. Yeah, people do. immediately assimilate to the culture. What I'm trying to say okay. by that is, if I, I, like, for me, for instance, in the culture that I'm going to get into, yeah. eventually, if I want to be part of that culture, unfortunately, just to get my career going, I can't be like this anymore. I can't have the beard and. Wait, what do you. What do you, you can have a beard. Horny. You can have a it's beard. Corny, but it's not corny. You I can have You can stand out. You'd be different. I'm not saying it I'm corny. Are changing I'm not saying I'm yeah. corny. I'm saying the rule. The rules are changing. The unwritten. Yeah. Especially for the professionalism, it's way changed. Professionalism really professional, is a professional. You'll see like new professionals, even in I your field. No, no, no. It's a different norm. It's different. Eh? It's a different norm. They'll fuck with you. But but the culture is still there not at the core. It depends. I guess it depends where you're at. No, it is. I agree with you. I guess it depends where you're at. I don't know. Your like, field so may be a little different. Yeah. Y'all, y'all are business niggas and y'all proper and shit. No. That's why I said, that's why I said it depends. Because like, like I said, when I worked in the music industry, niggas was tatted yeah, down to the fun. neck. It's fun. Yeah. So it depends It depends on the specific job you have. Because each job is different in its own way. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it, it, it's really just... 
I guess objective is the correct word to use. Um, I don't really fucking know. So as you were saying, you you, you were angry about no. No, I wasn't angry. I just understood. understood I wasn't angry. I didn't react. Like, 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 I just understood. People, remember when people were mad at Jeremy Lin for when he had uh, like those type. Those really just look terrible. Braids, whatever braids. Yeah, yeah. those just look terrible. Though. Yeah, but then he came. Those at, like eight one times. He came at some. He came at like oh, I think I forgot who it was. I think it was Kenny and Martin, and he's like, yo, he's like, yeah, but you have Chinese tattoos. I'm not calling you out for cultural appropriation. You call you calling at me for having a black type of hairstyle, but you got Chinese yeah. tattoos. No, which is fair. Like, yo, like, listen, yeah, like, you gonna speak? I'm gonna speak back. Which is yeah, fair. Like, listen, I don't react with that. that shit. I'm fair. just saying I, I understand. I, I think it's a good thing. I think we're like we're sharing culture and we're. we're I think it's bad when you profit over it, but we like you know what I'm saying. I feel like you should have an like, understanding. What's a what's a Spanish thing? Give me like a notable Spanish thing. I I don't know. Plantains. No, <laughs> I'm talking about like like. The, I saw someone bitching over chulos, uh, whatever that means. I have no idea what that means, but what that. What does that mean? Actually, you know, you know how Spanish Stop. gangs they wear the the button right here, at the top, and it's all spread out. They button up all their shit and they leave the bottom. Yeah, the there. like some white people Mexicans. appropriate Mexicans. that. Specifically, you never seen that? Specifically, Mexican gang dudes in LA. Yeah, it's like really super specific. specific. What well, I'm saying, it's like some people will take that and profit off that. Cholos, right? Oh, cholos. I don't. I, don't know. Cholos, I said I didn't know. Cholos are two different things. I just said I didn't. Forget, forget, don't worry about it. Yeah, but I'm saying like there's people appropriating that and selling it and making it out of profit. So I can see the frustration. It's like, yo, like what the fuck? Like, like this is something serious for us. Um, and sometimes it has a negative impact, whatever it may be, and you're just making some bread off it. I can't blame capitalism, but um, is it capitalism? Yeah, capitalism. capitalism. I'm tired, but I can't blame it at the same time. It's like, yo, like, why is that when we do it, it's frowned upon, but when you do it, it's. Mm-hmm. I feel like it oh, yo, it's exactly. Uh, this no, is a little bit. Exactly. It's like with the forties. Um, I think that happened example. in the Bronx with the forties in the bag. Um, they made a spot, and it was like, yo, like, nigga, we don't drink these shits. Like, that shit's rooted deep in hood communities, an and it's not a good thing. I'm terrible at explaining shit, but I'll give you an example where it's bad. I gotta look that up again. Here's an example where it's bad. There was this white high school that had a day called like Thug Day where they all dressed up in like NBA yeah, jerseys like, and did that. That's fucked up. That's cultural. Not only is that cultural, they even have to call it Thug Day. That's like stereotypes and, and they're, they're, they try to act as like caricatures of what black people are perceived in society. Yeah. That's bad. But then the, on the other hand, where someone just wearing braids a certain way, it's like braids is um, not that serious, my nigga. I'm not gonna. She got like Jamaican, like she got like the Jamaican beads in her hair, shit like that. Now nah, you say some racist shit and then wear some braids, yeah. and you have a problem. You, you, you know what I don't like? The the only reason why it bothers me a little bit I, I, that that culture appropriation, whatever the fuck appropriation, <laughs> yeah. appropriation, appropriation. I'm sorry, appropriation. I'm drinking too much monster. Anyways, what my, what bothers me about that is some people would try to like. My question is: Are you trying to blend in with the culture, or are you trying to just take one thing from the culture and you know, still be, still be, you, you, yeah. you know, away and that's, from? And that's the hard thing because at the end of the day, you people. really don't know. The issue is when sometimes when people get mad with culture appropriation is that we put the blame. I'm gonna use Danielle Bergoli, bad baby. She got braids. Mm-hmm. Everybody killed her. It's like, yo, you're blaming her for what people in the past did. And but she, she came back. Nothing. Like, someone roasted her, but she's like, black girls wear blonde weaves all the time. Yeah. They don't call you out for that. Sure. Like, but that's wings. what I'm saying. Like, we're blaming blonde certain people for wings. shit they had nothing to do with. That's like you having a white friend, Wait. and you're like, oh, it's your fault that was slavery. No, that wasn't that nah, specific that white person's fault. Well, yeah, that was the yeah. ancestors' fault, but they didn't no, do nothing. Yeah, you can't be. But you know what else it is? Like our young generation, all we know is like even white people and everything. All they know is like black, black culture. Because black culture is culture. Bro, one pop. thing I learned: it's it's like, no. rap music is pop. Yeah, music. everything like, changes as the years go. On. One thing so I didn't like, know was the mafia was a big thing like way way back in the day. So it's like we were appropriating Italian culture. Like yeah, yeah. like Jay Z had his mafia shit. Uh, I think Wu Tang Clan had some shit. Like all these different artists. Was the mobster, they love that yeah. mobster type of vibe, dress nice, but you hard and you do like crazy mm-hmm. shit. So it's like sometimes we need to take a step back and acknowledge that. I think we just get the it sucks to say that, but black people get the short end of the stick because at least we acknowledge it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think white people try to acknowledge it, but not all of them. But like, not all like, of them. When they, when like, I think our generation, the younger generation, our generation. Yeah, it's the older ones that are not acknowledging that are making the money like him. It's like, yo, my nigga, like. Now all of a sudden this shit is trendy because yeah, this bitch know. got braids. I, don't know. I remember, so. I remember this one video where this black girl was yeah, like attacking this white dude for having dreads, like nappy dread, like dread. Yeah. When I see some white people need to be stopped with that though, because they begin to look bad. Wait, hold on. They be looking yeah, like ramen noodles. Even if it looks bad. good or bad. Nah, but do it right. 
my my like question still nigga. comes back. Dude, like, right. White are people you had just... dreads in past too. I think like like what's called white people in Ireland, Ireland and shit had dreads. I'm just saying, do it right. What are you saying? Make it look nice, like you know, look presentable when you walk out mm-hmm. the house. Again, my only question is, are you just trying to pick something out of what a culture uses and not? Like fuck with them. Are, yeah. You understand are that you appreciating for what are it is, or are you stealing it? Yeah. Essentially. Are you appreciating these people, or are you just you just want that part, and you you still want to be like, yeah, fuck you. Yeah. I'm on this side of the table, you know what I'm saying? And that's the because hard part because you never know. I feel like it, it, it is like because here's my thing: actual racist people. They don't want you to be. They don't want to be associated with black culture at all. So oh. they're not. They're actual, not really. An actual racist person is gonna be culturally appropriating shit because he's he's like, oh, get that fucking rap music out my face. An actual racist person isn't gonna even fuck with your shit. Nah, I'm I'm gonna um I'm gonna refute that and say because this is something I notice a lot. And when I bring it up, and you probably start watching TV more, you'll notice it. Mm-hmm. There's a lot of underlying racism yeah, that's and shit. Underlying like I didn't realize. I can't, I wish I remember the show. I should have texted y'all about underlying it. Underlying racism. Now you see that. It's always been I just so happened to notice it on the show. And I was like, "What you the fuck?" I just noticed that. Yeah, this Disney Plus. Yo, we got Disney Plus now, and we're watching all those old like shows. No, that's obvious. Like, though. Damn, I'm like, talking about like not even obvious shit. Don't be like the low key shit. Uh, like, Disney was like the most racist. Yeah, yeah. he was anti Semitic. But I'm yeah. saying like, yo, like these motherfuckers be racist as shit, and then just sliding in through like little slight jokes, and you just be laughing because you don't realize it because you're already laughing, and you're in a fuck shit mood. But if you not, you just like. Chilling you here You're like what the fuck But if fuck? you think about it Those were innocent times No I'm talking about now I'm talking about It was a what? current show It was it was like a new episode My nigga Like I just don't remember What the fuck I was watching Like But it was definitely I should have I wanted to text out I was like I don't really want to talk to you At the moment It was late at night I didn't care I think I was supposed to take you out, but go, go on I'm gonna, I'm gonna nah, show you, I want to show you I want to show you something uh, I wanted you to react to something real quick in a second, though. Oh, I'll react. React. I mean, I don't know if we could My like thing arrange is, the video. You can have someone wear. You can have like a, a certain person wear dreads as, that doesn't consistently wear from that culture, or whatever. A white person, how you want to say it? Yeah, that's fine. But my thing is, I, I don't be racist. We're gonna do that. I can bet money on it that they probably don't even fuck with like Sucks. Jamaicans, or they probably don't. Like, that's why we gotta start taking white people. I can bet on it. That's why we gotta start taking white people shit, yo. Just like we do. I don't know what white we people do. have. But we do. We, we take everything. I don't really want what they got. And, and, and it's like, first of all, other no, than generational wealth. First of all, no culture owns anything. I'm sorry, I, I hate that shit. No culture owns anything, but they can control it. Like if that makes any yeah, sense. Yeah, they can control the trend, maybe, but. No one owns anything. Yeah. No one signed the patent. Sometimes it's hard no to. Or anything. What makes it owned is that can you do it, and can you reinvent the wheel on it? Like with our culture, with black culture, we continuously reinvent the wheel of our culture and make it better and better and better to the point where everybody's saying like, "Yo, we gotta do this. We gotta do this. We gotta do this." Can you fucking do that? Can you take our culture and sit there and say, "Okay, but we got this. We got the framework. The iPhone. We got the iPhone. Let's make the iPhone too now." Like you know what I'm saying? And that answer is a no. White people can't do that shit. They're not going to start off with drip and then get to the next word next year. They're not. They're not going to... They, come on, bro. They're still on floss. They're still doing that floss and dance. Like, <laughs> my nigga, like, y'all... They're dying with that floss and dance right now, and it's been, like, three years. You got to understand. Sometimes it takes time for them to get to... Okay, but by the time they do that, bro, we're light years ahead. That's what I'm saying. It's like, bro, think about it from a business. Like, okay, you got a phone, I got a phone. Are you gonna make another phone? Cause Apple's coming out. Samsung, what are you doing? Like, come on, let's go. Chop, chop, chop. Like, you can't just sit there and say, "Oh, let's take some time." Nigga, what? They're on Bluetooth right now. You're still using wires. I don't know if they are, but you get what I'm saying. Like, it's like it doesn't matter if you take your time. If someone else is doing something better than you, like, what the you fuck do you mean? Better? What? It's an opinion. The wires? No, or I'm saying culture. Like, the, the the no, culture. it's it's what better. Saying, what you talking about? Like, culture, our culture is better. Cultural innovation. Culture innovation. Like you, you, you've been you've been innovating. Yeah, it's you, better because with rap and and how to it's like, better because it's not even arguably it literally is the number one thing as of right now and it's been that way for a few years actually since streaming happened and social media has gotten more prominent. It's black culture has been the number one thing. It's been emulated. People are trying to replicate it and be us. Like it's there a norm is, now. No, it's a norm. It's a norm. Like. like and it's been like that for a long time, but now it's just fucking ridiculous. Like, black culture's always been uh, copied, but now it's just fucking ridiculous. You still looking for that video? Now it's just it, fucking man. ridiculous. It's like, like god damn. Like, I'm, I'm going to give an example of how big it's, it's been. Like, 
It's I, arguably, I, I, bro. I go to a school where not a lot of black people go to yeah. that school, bro, and they all listen to similar shit that Amro listens to and you listen to. Exactly, because nothing else to listen to. And it, it's weird. It's just slap. It, cause, cause, cause you hear them. That, you know, they, uh, you see them white people them. dancing like, oh, to the baby doing. Baby. Uh, uh, I love uh, little baby. Uh. I'm like, what? Yeah. Or I love the baby, and I'm like, what? Black culture is, is the yeah, most influential and in, influential culture of. Damn. Yeah, for sure. How far do we go? I don't. Of history, I don't. I don't know. History. I'm not gonna sit there and think that deep into that. Okay. We'll let people decide. All right. I want you to react to the video. So. All right, Emro. So this is a is that Lizzo? Big contentious issue on on Twitter right now. Both y'all. Can you turn it up? Oh, she slapped the ass. He slapped the ass. That was fucked up. Wait, Girl, it didn't happen yet. Oh, no. Oh, it happened. Okay. Anyway, okay. Some, I don't. I don't. The dude slap. You I literally. You literally. Um. No, you have the right video. It's about to happen. His video doesn't matter. What happened was. Anyway, this yeah. Is reporter, there's like a mile run thing. There's like a, a ma- um, marathon run, and this girl's reporting on it. And one of the runners is like comes up, sees her like talking to the camera. He wants to make himself known. He slaps her on the ass and keeps walking. Yeah. This shit, she reported this dude for sexual assault, and mm-hmm. it's like she, she's shocked, and Twitter's outraged, and people are calling it sexual assault. She, she was is. sexually assaulted by this him. Yeah, is. I just want to hear y'all y'all takes on it. It is. It's sexual assault. It was just like a, it was like a sportsman-like sexual tap on assault the butt. Sexual assault No, it was not a sports tap, nigga. He whined that shit. It doesn't he even matter. That shit. Yeah, well, it doesn't matter. I don't know you. Okay. Like, how would you feel if... The, like for most men, they're nasty. No, nah, actually, I would be dumb type of woman to smack my ass. And yeah, yeah, yeah. fucking tight. Okay, smacking my butt for it. Like that's so, not that's a no no. That's a no no, bro. I don't know. I I think it was. What you want to get off your chest over here? Cause you huffing and puffing. Let me give you my take. Let me give you my take before you do this, because I don't know. You about to come with some spicy shit. We're gonna <laughs> so, have to wrap the podcast up after that. It's fucked up. I don't like calling it sexual assault because I feel like that's a little too far. Because it doesn't have to be sexual. But it's fucking figure. Anyway, it's a, come on. It but at matter. the same time, her, the, he harassed her. I think it was more yeah, harassment. You can't just be touching people. You bro. can't slap people. Doesn't yeah, matter. I agree. I agree. Just you in can't, general, you can't be slapping can't be touching people. You can't be slapping a girl you don't know in the ass just because you think it's funny. It's not. You can't cool. be touching people in general, my nigga. Like, I, how would you feel someone random just walking but, you? I hate to say it, but I think they're taking it too far, though. With what? No. People calling it sexual assault. Like, like I think that's Dude. that is sexual assault. I feel like that's like one step under rape. You sexual assault. It is. Do you think a little sexual assault is one step on the road? Yeah, but do you think that? Do you think that line. case is like a? So what? Under? Look at the other side. What other side of this? To, okay, give me. What's the other side of this nigga slapping her ass? Give me a second. I think it was more a playful thing. He knew it was on give camera. It's not cool. You don't touch we anyone. Know it's not you don't put cool. your hands on anyone. Don't slap a girl. Do y'all know it's not cool? cool? You just told me to look at the other side. Like, what other side is it to yeah, look I'll at? Yeah, the other side, bro. It's one thing. I, it's one thing if I know her. This like, is. This is. But do you think he should get like canceled over it? Like, do you think he has a job? You think Can't, I don't fun? believe in cancel culture, so mm, um, I don't know. That nigga probably took I, a job. I just don't think this dude should lose his career over something that I think it's a. I think he definitely made her uncomfortable. He crossed some boundaries. He definitely took her hands. I guess her. my take makes no yeah, sense because up. it's already a regular bias. Like, no, nah, speak your mind, kid. There's, there's no point because speak your mind. When I speak my mind, I'm I'm interested in what your thoughts are, but you your but thoughts are in one place. Because there's certain things where it's like, why should I have to expand on that? It's kind of fucked up. What do don't, you want to say? Don't touch anyone. That's my thing. What do you want to say? What do you want to say? Because you're expanding your brain. So what do you want to say? So, all right. So what I want to say is, of course, I agree with you. It's wrong, man. You shouldn't be touching a random girl. Especially uh-huh. a random girl. Girls have super superpowers now. You can't do shit like that. You shouldn't be touching random people, period. You can't be touching random anyone, touching, anyone, period. Don't touch people, period, unless yeah. they unless they think so, they're cool with it. So what's the button in this? My point is... The the uh, the exaggeration of I feel like sexual assault is a little too far. Personally. Of the is the punishment. What was the punishment? I mean nothing. She's she pressed charges. That's early. This shit just happened. It's so early in the she, She's pressing sexual assault well, charges. Look, okay. Or batter sexual battery. Imagine. Charges. Okay. I'm I'm gonna imagine What's sexual that battery. Battery means like like you're like, not not unex- battery means unexpected. Like you uh-huh. like you didn't see it coming at all. Okay. Battery is so you feel the so charges if, if were a unnecessary. Not, if a nigga's not looking, you hit him with a baseball bat. That's battery. Yeah. I, I, so so you, wait. So you're trying to tell me you feel like the punishment was unnecessary? I feel like the the punishment is exaggerated. I think so. It's what exaggerated. should have happened? 
I think you should definitely get scolded for it, get in trouble. But you uh, should definitely get in trouble for it. What would be trouble? I don't think so. that's where that's where it, I'm not a lawyer. If you give, sexual if you give but a, a lawayer said it was sexual assault. Sexual assault is different. That's, worse, that's worth, worse than speeding. You know, give him a ticket. <laughs> you know what the fuck? You should go to jail for it. You should lose his job for it. I don't think you should go to jail for that. You think he should go to jail? No, for I said I don't. I, said, I don't think he should go to jail that's for that. That's should lose his job. Wild. If he has like a public position, that's what's gonna happen. No sexual assault. If he if he's like it depends on the company. If he's like a if the company's losing, because now you gotta look at from the business perspective. If I'm an owner of a company and if everybody's tearing my company apart. You gotta go, nigga. He's like a CEO. Ah, CEO is different. CEO it makes sense, but if you're like, if you're, yeah, just, yeah it depends. He's gonna go to check, check this. If out. you're a CEO, you, you get fired for that. For you sure. have to. You have this to. nasty. You have to replay this in your mind. I'm, I'm a runner. I'm walking. I'm trying to be fucking funny, and There's it's not camera. funny. It's, it's not funny. You shouldn't touch anybody. That's a grown ass man. He's a grown ass man. If it was like a teenager, I probably would have Mind you, in front of him, no, a lot, no. a lot of people are like, not harassing her. They're like sitting there talking. No, they, they're just doing that. Yeah. yeah. So he's like, oh, let me get on this. Let me one up it and, and right. smack her on the yeah, ass. Let's not do an ageist thing here. Mm. I don't care if he's a but teenager. But why does that have to be? But I'm sorry. Is that act inherently sexual though? It's just a little slap on the butt. Is yeah. that a sexual act? Mm. I guess it is. I understood what he was doing. He was doing like, ah, I got an eyelash in my eye. But he was doing, he was like doing like a, a good game thing. Like good game, but no. Like, you don't, don't know that because we're not in his head. Yeah. It doesn't matter. But he could have been one of He should have known better. He should have known better. He should have known better to not go smacking random people's ass. Not even letting me finish. How would you feel if someone smacked You're your ass? Even, you, it depends. If someone if you're just chilling on your business on the subway? I'm like, if someone pushing? smack my ass, I'll be tight. Yeah, I'm be dumb tight. I'm like, yo, this I'm dude is bl- tripping. I'm gonna black on them, but, but you're not, I'm not gonna black. You're not gonna file a police. But it was an ugly bitch. You're not gonna file a police report. <laughs> I'm not filing a police report. Yeah, you're not uh, gonna file. Ugly That's mad work. That's mad work. I'm not doing all what that. What if a nigga did it? I'm still not filing a police report. What if a nigga slap your ass? Now, if you slap <laughs> it and grab it, I'm filing a police report. Like, <laughs> <laughs> he might have grabbed it, bro. Like, if you go like this, like. <laughs> Like he's like, yo, mm. he's bring that ass. The, the, I had to file a police report, nigga. Either, uh, but he smacked my shit and keep going. I'm just gonna ignore it. Detail of is it a firm grip? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but if nigga smack my ass to get off the subway, I'm just gonna be mad. Grab the ass. Who but you know, wait. Okay, but you. It, I think in a normal setting, I'm gonna I'm gonna cop him some bail. In a normal setting, I think she would have let it rock. But I think because of the fact that it was on TV, it adds an extra level of embarrassment. <laughs> Fucking famous. Let she was already on TV. It's not like she's looking for fame. She's a news girl. Right? Yeah, I think because it's on TV, that's embarrassing, my nigga. Like this is your job, and now it's like now, I, I now you're forever known as the girl that got her ass smacked on TV. I guarantee she's niggas gonna, gonna, gonna run with that. I guarantee she's gonna drop the charges. She might, no, I don't think so. I think she'll drop. No. If I'm a woman, I'm not dropping charges. The social media influence, the, influence, the people that are around you, not if you get the company to back it. And you and she could get lawyers on pro bono. They will love that. Maybe I'm wrong. I mean, slapping on the ass is wrong. It's just but, fucked up. But really quickly, really think it's quickly do better. The, the point that I was trying to make, just imagine yourself being that runner. You want to one up. You trying to be funny or whatever the case may be. You you pulled it. Let me finish. Let me finish. Could have pulled I'm going to give you the feminist perspective after this. Though. That's I'll fine. That's fine. I slap her ass. I try mm. to be funny. It's corny. You're not I'm supposed ready. to do it. You're a grown ass man. That's fine. That's fine. And then the next thing you know, there's papers coming to your home. And you're being accused of, of, of sexual, sexual assault. assault and and you're going to go to prison because of what just happened. He's going to prison? That's He's going to happens. go like, to like, prison. Sexual assault. You don't if go, you have a good... Yes, 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 yes. It, it depends on what time. Depends on the severity. And, and it depends how good your lawyer is, too. You might not go to prison. It's not, you're not going to jail for that, no. I think I think you go to jail. You get arrested Dude. for it. You're not like, like a little baby jail. You go to jail. Nah, you go to prison. I'm, I'm serious. Like no, I think I have to pay a fine. I just made sure. Then why did you tell us? Phone, I just made sure. Your phone's off. The Fuck with you. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, but, but think about that. That's... All right, feminist perspective. You want to hear the other side, bro? Okay, bet. Women live in a society where they're constantly being preyed upon, where they can't feel safe walking down the street because if they see a man walking beside them, they'll be like, oh, I don't know if this is a predator or not. I don't know what he's going to do. I don't know his intentions. So women are constantly living in, like, it's, it's reasonable for a woman to constantly be in fear that she's going to be either sexually assaulted, raped, whatever it may be. So she's just, this girl is a reporter. She's living there. She might have had bad past experiences with men where some dudes try to take advantage of her. They might put, a, put their hands on her. She could get traumatized. She might be traumatized from shit like that. So that dude came, slapped the ass. She doesn't know what's going on. There's a bunch, of men. There's a bunch of men harassing her. She doesn't know what's going on. She doesn't feel safe. 
maybe maybe we should criminalize some, that type of behavior and so sometimes you gotta set an example I'm gonna be example. honest with you there you go sometimes it's you gotta set an example this is a feminist perspective so, one nigga slapping ass every nigga slapping ass it's so, like booty tag so so then you believe that you should go to prison uh, I mean I'm just laying out the argument I don't believe that I, I believe just, he, I just laying out the double strike personally I believe he you, could, you could keep going because with your thing. double because here's the thing you, okay. all right, here's now that was my devil's advocate thing now here's me in general in a vacuum that situation alone if you're ignoring society context and and the experience of being a woman that's some real feminist shit but if you ignore the experience of being a woman and ignore everything in general that, that shit he just slapped her ass it's not that serious it's not big deal if you're in a vacuum, that situation, nothing else, you're ignoring society's context. That's not that serious. You just slapped her butt. It's not that serious. It's just, you, no, no, you're no. going to be okay. You didn't get physically hurt from it. It's not that serious. I wanted you to but keep your feminist perspective. Once, 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 once you put in, once you put the situation in context of, she's this is a, this is a man, like putting putting his hand on a woman heart, like a heavy handed man put his hand on, on a on a woman that wasn't expecting it you know it's in her perspective she, I could, she could feel some type of way she, she could have had like she a, a, a scarring past or whatever the case yeah. may be and and that that, that that could actually be very traumatizing there I brought the feminist out of you no ah, I understand that I that's my goal I won <laughs> no yo alright let's, let's wrap this one up um, cause we're in an hour half we have to like link the video to some shit yeah let's um any final statements or we're done here Ah, so ah, ah, I don't know. What'd you say to be in my pocket? If the glove doesn't fit, I didn't do it. I don't know. I did that. You said I, final did, oh, 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 I did not say that at the beginning oh, of the podcast. Oh, my bad. Um, <laughs> all right. Well, thank you for listening to another episode of Completely Irresponsible. Remember, son, yo, you actually no, hold on. Like, yeah, thank you for listening to another episode of Completely Responsible. I just want to say, you know, anybody listening out here, thank you, yo, you really cosmic, like. Your vibrations is just oozing out of you, and the Milky Way is philanthropy. Um, thank you, Monster. Thank you, Lacroix. Facts. Uh, thank you, Britta. Thank you, thank Assange. Thank you, Boys Club. Yeah. Um, what else we have uh, on this table? Thank you, uh, Bombay yeah. for the gin. Thank you, Sapphire. And thank you, Apple. We got the outro.